been nine months since I've yeah. been subscribed to the shiny boy. I'm clicking the unmute button. There we go. Okay. That's true. Stop on me, oh my god. I would like it to stay unmuted, Streamlabs. Thank you very much. Okay. I don't know how much of that actually got through, because Streamlabs kept muting everything. Can we mute for one second? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why? What do you need? None your business, because you won't mute. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they wanted to tell you a secret. Mm -hmm. Maybe a secret secret. Here's my phone number. I do. <laughs> Shiny out here just giving this number out to anybody these days. I have Shiny's number. Yep. Cool I, I, kids get Shiny's yeah. number. Yeah. 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 I have his number too. I'm saying he's just giving out to anybody these days. <laughs> So wait, if cool kids get his number, what kind of people get to live with him? Fools. <laughs> well, damn. <laughs> oh my. <sighs> Got a nice big glass of milk. Milk. So, what feats did everyone pick? Yeah. I have the, the crusher feed. Ooh, nice. I have the mounted combatant feed. <laughs> and, yeah. Because I'm always on somebody. <laughs> I got the tough feed because Shiny keeps targeting me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wish I had grabbed that one already. Well, I couldn't. I, oh, yeah, I'm multi-classing multi so oddly that I haven't had a <laughs> you haven't had boost. Yet, no. Yeah. I picked up the Meta Magic Adept. Ooh, nice. Which one? Oh. I'm keeping that part to myself until I need it. <laughs> <laughs> Not giving Shiny uh, any chances. <clears throat> oh my god, if Shiny's only I just can like, your character sheet. I, I know, I was gonna say it like again. <clears throat> oh man. <clears throat> no, see, Shiny can know, and Shiny can look it up. It's just the rest of y'all. Good. Good you, man. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Really, you're not oh, gonna yeah. tell me after I called you an asshole and a piece of shit, and then said I love you? <laughs> you know, it's remarkably, it's being called an asshole and a piece of shit that I just don't like. There's no stronger bond between brothers. <laughs> that is true. If I have a brother, and even him and I don't do that kind of shit, we will sit there and insult each other on a regular basis, where, to the point where... In the middle of it all, my dad accidentally got called a dumb gum dumpster. Oh, but still. <laughs> this is all being recorded. Yeah, Man knows what he <laughs> likes, right? I, I mean, uh, they don't, I have referred to him as a whore, so. I got elven accuracy. Ah, oh, nice. that's nice. Yeah. Elven accuracy is really good. Yep. My backup character has the elven accuracy. Mm -hmm. Just in case Shiny wants to keep him closer. Always have a backup character, just in case. If Gulch does ever die, I'm taking a year off. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's god. too long! He's He is honestly my favorite character I have ever made. Don't oh, worry, Ezra won't let him die. <laughs> yeah. On that note, I would like to do the recap. Where are my notes? I will not do the recap as I am eating my chicken that time on.
I could do the recap if everyone's okay with Shiny getting another point. <laughs> I was <sighs> here for the last bit, so I would be the worst one to do the recap. I could, I could do it. Go I can it. do it as well. Um, yeah. Well, you go first. Time. Hell no. We have very different thought processes. You first, mm. sir. The air he talked to Carter. Talking to you. Oh. He, he was talking. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, so we picked up with last game with Aiden, uh, at the Mai, our new friend, uh, Hellman, uh, Saki, and Azura, all in the, um, Tavern slash pub, um, awaiting, uh, death with Golden Leaphorn, not knowing that they have been arrested for different reasons, and, uh, placed in jail cells. Um, Jaden sleeping, and, um, Elman going into some meditation and uh, Saki and Adamai being sneaky little con artists. In that meantime, uh, Gulch and the Horn were both in their cells. Gulch actually managed to find a secret um, hole or doorway out of his jail cell, telling me to go back for it. Um, Gulch successfully put on a fake mustache and hid it in the crowds and uh, ended up spotting us and up with us telling us what has happened uh, everyone besides really Jaden and Adamai uh, went into the prison to get the horn out everything was going rather smoothly trying to get Leo Horn out of his jail cell. A little too smoothly. And then they went to go find the stuff that got taken from them by the guards. Still everything going a bit too smoothly. And during that time, some uh, rogues actually dropped down and drugged both Jaden and Adamai. Uh, when they came to, they awoke in the, this big room filled with people camping in a circle. One man in the middle, the Duke. With their friends surrounding them up, ready to fight. And uh, Leohorn, ready to exact his revenge on the Duke. Uh, combat occurred. Uh, Jaden had a bit of a moral dilemma as whether to help fight or not, eventually siding with his friend to take down the Duke. Uh, after some very like heavy losses of people going down multiple times and hitting back up, um, Zura eventually joined the group again. Um, Running to Gulch's aid to pick him up and to help people heal. And creatures, dragons being summoned to help fight a giant mechanized creature. Uh, the Duke eventually fell. Uh, Leohorn got his room. Like, stop making that face! <laughs> you look crazy! Uh, I also believe Gulch got uncursed towards the end there by Azura after the fight. 
because I remember he got cursed from um, breaking a pact with Leohorn. Yep. And I believe we said we finished off by going back to the tavern. We didn't make the tavern yet. We also forgot something else. It was really yeah. short, mm -hmm. right at the end. Spooky voice! Spooky voice in Gulch's head. Oh, that's, that's <clears throat> right. The spooky voice of Gulch's head. And he chose to ignore because magic bullshit. <laughs> I didn't ignore, I just didn't like... comprehend. There's a difference. I like how the spooky voice only went in Gulch's head. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Gulch, would you like to start up? this session with a uh, Arcana check? Honestly, no. Okay. I'll do it. <laughs> I'll Don't just write that down as a natural hey. one. <laughs> oh, sorry, a natural two? A <laughs> natural 20, let's go. For right. a total of 20. You recognize that was a sending spell. To you. Okay. Which <clears throat> you Good also person. know. They have to know you to s do a sending spell. Like, not just read about me in a magazine, but, like, have met me? Not oh, quite. Oh, this is a magazine? You... Yes, we expedition. Like, well, if... Oh. I guess, technically, if you had somebody that gave you a very accurate and detailed description and had something of yours, it could work as enough content to put a sending to you. Right. Like, there's ways to circumvent not actually knowing you, but more often than not, they have to know and know that it's you specifically and not a random satyr called Gulch. Right. Um, can I do... Because we were, we were ending pretty quick. Uh, yeah. Can I do, like, an insight check to see if I recognize the voice? You can. You can also respond with 25 words or less. Okay, uh, so remind me what did it say? It said, mm -hmm. if something, something, it will see me soon. I will see you soon, type thing. Basically, yeah. It goes, ah, you're doing some shit. I'll see you soon. Basically, no. That's basically what it said. Alright, I'm gonna respond. <clears throat> a really creepy voice, so try and make your best creepy voice. <clears throat> I gotcha. <laughs> 25 words or less, right? Yep. Alright. Bring me flowers and wear that little number I like. That's it. <laughs> I was expecting Is that or something like, Dad? Uh, Father? Is that you? So after the call... <laughs> I guess we'll do this really quick. After the fight, and everything starts to slide down, to like calm down, Gulch begins to panic or like freak out a little bit. And then he just out of nowhere blurts that out. Yeah, I, uh, I asked him if he was okay. Azura was grabbing him by the arms. What? Yeah. Uh, Gulch, yeah. What, what are you talking about? Long there, there was some dude in my head just now being like, oh. You do win stuff, I'm gonna see you soon. And I, I said, please bring me flowers and wear that little number that I like. So, did someone you make that more sexy. On you? That... <laughs> you made that more sexy than it had to be. <laughs> hey, I mean, yeah. Have you met me? Strikes a JoJo pose. <laughs> <laughs> Does your I think, go back? buddy, buddy, I love the confidence. I think that was more of a threat. Like of course call. it was a threat, but what can I do? I don't know magic. In some yeah, like... it was. I'm not that interested. They'll, they said they were gonna see me, so eventually I'll know. I don't want any spoilers. Was it your mom? No, it didn't like, sound like someone. My mom. It's about like one of her advisors. They've got my number. They would just. 
rung my phone or sent me a message. Honestly, it was probably something, some like someone having to do with the uh, blood guy. What? I will worry about it when it happens. I still don't know what this blood guy looks like. I don't think any of us do. We? You guys <laughs> saw him. him. Thanks for the, oh, the yeah, alert. Oh no, mind. Game. We Ooh. thoroughly fought him, and we did see. Him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, in this group, <laughs> uh, it's just Gulch and Leader War. <laughs> yeah, so what? we're gonna have to rely on Leo Horn. I'm not the best with faces. So, I need the three who weren't in that battle to either choose to fail this wisdom save throw, or make a wisdom saving throw. Oh, I'll fail. Um, I guess I'll fail? My wisdom isn't that good anyway. For what reason? Why are we doing He's gonna show us something. Oh, sure, whatever, I'll fail. And you're all charmed. No, uh... <laughs> you, all, you see Leo Horn's hands like kind of spread apart as he does whenever he's like showing something along with the verbal story. Ooh. And then it, you see uh, kind of like a silent film rolling of Flint, or, or a maybe half high elf <clears throat> knocking over barrels of blood. What clearly looks like Natasha was not, yeah, Natasha was with us during that time. Gulch and what appears to be Leo Horn's hands as they round the corner with a couple of their party members you don't recognize. As a person who's rising out of the blood, and you see Blood Guy. And you hear, you don't really hear, but you see subtitles of, uh, thank you, Flint, for the blood. As he ends the spell. Oh, oh, I heard about that. Oh, about that? Definitely looks concerning. And who, okay, so if this guy is referred to as Blood Guy, why does the idiot? Why is the idiot tipping over barrels of blood? You never met. Well, him. he kind of gave me the after. Like okay. He just wanted to see if there was anything other than blood in it. Okay. Believe it or not, he was one who was hired to actually come after me. Yes. yes. More weird the more I know you. I think that's bad. And he I constantly fell off of tall objects. <laughs> Gulch and I theorized that he's gonna come back as a Star Trek. Yes. I think you guys are fantastic. <laughs> I just... You see the phantasm in his eyes, like, just like, yes. That's what I've been dreaming for. <laughs> I'll sort of give him a thumbs up and a big grin. <laughs> she doesn't know what's going on. Gulch matches the energy. <laughs> But yes, because Flint tipped over those barrels of blood, he got significantly stronger, and then we kind of had to skedaddle on out of there for face death. Of the permanent kind. <laughs> the permanent. What kind of death is now per- Don't answer that. The kind where you still have a soul afterwards. I said I answered. <laughs> Before finishing the fight. She, she connected the dots. So, how about we leave? I would like very much. I, yeah. I, I, I'm guessing we're gonna have to now flee this country. I mean, I wasn't expecting Wait. to come back here, so... No Did you want to go tour something? Or were you expecting to be welcome back after killing that guy? I don't... 
we weren't technically here to kill that guy. Oh, uh, yeah, we well, were. Well, we did. So, yeah, maybe he was not along the way. But I was. You see, there's a... Gold and I had to sneak across the border here. Duke fell in here was kind of a happy little accident. As the horn swiftly kicks the corpse. And I was I, I was drugged. I feel taken advantage of. Yeah, no worries. We killed the guy. You want one of his fingers? You a leg? Know. He already has. Like, Wasn't him. It was technically his roads. I don't know what they did to me when I was a cop. You may want to get tested. Okay. I have to. <laughs> uh, but. It probably would be smart for us to keep on. I know we came out here to for information. Blood guy, but a dead duke of the area yeah, is I'd going to bring more than a few thousand. This country, that's like a long. That's what at least like a day's journey. Yeah, well, I mean, now that my mom knows the duke is dead, there's probably going to be like an invasion or something. So we should skedaddle. Um, does anyone yeah, have a bag I could put this head in? The horn tosses you the bag of holding. Boop. Puts the duke's head in there. Uh, I think that's going to make a great trophy on the bookshelf when we get back. Oh, yes. Um, Gulch, do you think we should it's probably pull the same maneuver we did really, here? Really quick. Um, rot. As you guys are grabbing the head, that um, make a... I don't know, I feel like a perception check. Well, I had already ripped this head off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, like, you're messing with the head now, putting it in the bag as well. Right. Uh, 23 on perception. <clears throat> 27 on perception. Does this have anything to do with smell? Nope. All right, so that is a total of 20. Uh, Gulch, uh, the head feels softer than it should. And this isn't like a... As soon as you were touching it, it's like as you've had this conversation, and now you're putting it in the bag, it's starting to feel soft. Um, this head is decaying very rapidly. Also, remember the the blood that pulled out was this really thick black substance. Right. Should I just in the head? You want me to use uh? <clears throat> Until repairs. Yeah. I thought I had that. Gulch gets a bloody nose actually making the spell. Bloody <laughs> <laughs> uh, nose, matter, splitting headache. As a matter of fact, Gulch, you're, you're holding this head. Can you make a constitution save for me? Why must you do this to me? I am but a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Nothing to sniff at. Um, is this against a spell effect? No. Or poison? No? Okay. No. Uh, 16 plus 8. Uh, also, remember you're within range of one gun. So that's plus that one? Yeah. He's making a plus save. Plus two now! Uh -huh. Plus two? Oh! oh. Eight, 18 plus 8. 26. Alright. You may continue. Alright, gentle reposes on it. Let's pop mm -hmm. it in the bag and... Get the fuck out of here. And this is going in your bag I, of holding? Like that. Yep. Okay. Don't take the head away from me. Don't be mean. Alright, um. <clears throat> so the. If the five of you want to, uh. Probably take the heport teleport back to Markash. Uh, I don't think we'll be able to. Uh, okay, we'll always try the Dairon or the Paxton one, or maybe the Dram. I think closest like to us is. is uh, I think I think forces have been alerted by now about well, us since I mean, we yeah. were kind of drugged and brought here. And there was no <laughs> resistance to getting here, so. We might just have to run for it. Yes, we probably will. Which I can carry 
Bon Bon, but you guys gotta figure something out. Yeah, uh, speaking of which, hey Bon Bon, do you have any more healing? Uh, I... As you look at Jade, you realize he's like kind of got this really big gash down his the center of his of his chest. I bet like 27 out of 83. Yeah, I Good see. Lord. A lot yeah. of you guys got hurt real bad. Yeah. yeah. Um, how about I give you 20 points of healing? Thank you. Can, right, I, uh, can I try something? You want to you try something? I do. What, what do you, you want wanna, to try? I'm going to walk up to uh, Jada. I'm going to put my hands up in like a boxing stance. Very I'm close. Just, I'm just going to... I'm just going to hook punch you in the head. And as soon okay. as it makes contact, there's no pain. You don't, like, stagger, but you regain five hit points. What? I don't know. It's just something I found out I could do recently. And I'm using Hand of Healing. Whoa. You punch him! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That, that didn't hurt? I actually feel a little bit better now. How does that work? I don't know. Still trying to figure it out, but it's pretty fucking sick. Is that like part of your faith? Yeah. No clue. No idea. But Weird. I know a little bit of magic. <laughs> wow! I have a question. Everyone's gonna come up behind you. Really quick. Grip your shoulder. Uh, you is, sure the, is the stuff in your backpack actually in your bag of holding, or is only your god awful coat in the bag of holding? Currently, it's only the god awful coat. Okay. It's not god awful, it's stylish! <laughs> I'm at like 25 of me. 25 out of what? 25 out of. I don't know. 72. Okay, I can. Uh, uh, we're gonna do. Two. I would probably be able to heal myself over time anyway. It just... The way I see it is just take... Stuff. I don't know, I will I'll do second level healing. You'll get 16 points of health. Thank you. Eight. <laughs> Eight. And Jaden, you, you feel Leo Horn's hand on your shoulder grip. Just a little uncomfortable as you feel 11 HP going to you. Before he uh, drops and walks forward, not even looking. All right, let's see. Uh, so I can cast Long Strider. Try and get a little bit more speed on our way out of here. Um, Hellman, can you still cast any spells? Uh, yeah. I can cast spells, and I also have. Uh... I have the ability to do something similar to launch trade, so... Ah, right, perfect. Uh, are you able to put it on other people? Uh, no. Uh, I don't think I have any disguise spells. Uh, long strider is, uh, movement speed, so... Uh, okay. It's still a little faster. Yeah, I have no, no spells. I can make you guys invisible. That, ooh, that could, that could really help. That definitely could. Hmm. How, for how long would we be invisible? How many of us? Uh, usually can make one of you invisible. Usually, to last for about a minute, actually. Oh, is that greater you're talking about? Uh, yeah, greater invisibility. I can spend the energy to cast Long Strata, and if you want to cast invisibility as we start getting closer to the uh, gates, Long Strata lasts for about an hour. We can get to out of Heaport. 
make our way back across that island, past where the uh, elemental was, crash for the night, recuperate, and then the... Hmm. Uh, Gulch, how many people can you carry in total? I could carry all of you, but this, there's this weird god that's like, oh, you're only at half movement. <laughs> what? <laughs> Well, just your nose is pointing all of it. Looks up. <laughs> looks directly at camera. <laughs> Why are you looking but, uh, at that wall? Real talk, carrying capacity 300 pounds, push dragger lift 600 pounds. Okay. I might not need anyone to carry me either because I can fly and I have 50 and with long strider he is 60. Yeah, uh, well, the thought process is getting up over the uh, wall. I yeah. can I can use action dash to get back to seventy five feet of movement. Uh, yeah, well, let's just can we get him up and over because oh, yeah, the descent is, is going to be no problem whatsoever because we know this guy's feather ball. Yeah, My high I jump actually, is thirty four feet plus a D A plus an athletics check. Okay. If Jade can fly himself over there, I know Adam I and I can fly up and over. So you really don't have to worry about carrying the two of y'alls. Let me quickly check the uh, spell length time for Featherfall. So I'd rather you not die to fall damage. I think, I think Featherfall is about a minute. It's 60 feet around, I, I think. I have uh, one reaction when you or a creature within 60 feet of you falls. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, just a five creature, five falling creatures. Mm. I mean, All if right. I'm carrying people, you only really have to hit me. Yeah, and I can always just time medicine to match yours. There we go. Oh no, uh, it's not okay. And I have, I also can uh, double my movement speed with Step of the Wind dash at him. Oh, yeah. So that means I can get up to, what, that's 120? Did I do math right? Yeah, I have I have one key point left, so I can only do that once, if need be. I'm fairly certain that you used all your key points, not not you, Bulge, but Jane. Because I remember the words, I'm going to use my last key point. Oh. <gasps> Also, we get to the top of that wall after a long rest. No, well, I have, I have, I have one. Oh, yeah. I have okay, one because one we leveled up. up. Yeah, one from leveled up. Oh, yeah. very nice. Mm -hmm. I have one. Oh, with the right, with, I have the one fourth level spell slot. Uh, we can always just get, if we can just get ourselves to the top of the thing, as long as it's like not 500 feet down to the bottom, I can always just cast Dimension Four. That's awesome. We have options. We have options. We have options. Um, Azura, how many spell slots do you have left? You mean smite slots? Smite slots! Uh, four level one, one second level, three third level. So okay. she came in really late to the fight, so she's. Yeah. 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 Even if uh, we have to take some fall damage, I'm at 160 health points and we have a also remember, you guys are no. Oh, you mean like the the walls of the city? Right. Okay. I mean like the walls of the. Uh, you are border. nowhere near the border. And I'm thinking close when we get closer to the border. You we're are getting up and over because the walls of the city would be relatively easier. Nowhere. And yeah, I'm, just, I'm thinking in the future. I can also so burrow if we need to dig a hole. I forgot we have our diggy diggy gulch. <laughs> Turn our dwarf. I can make a door. That's a dwarf. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that, that's not like Shiny had said earlier. He was like, you want to start in a place that has one exit. If gulch, we'd never have a Exit strategy? Never heard of it. <laughs> Exit strategy. Make a new. <laughs> He's like, okay, so Gulch gets out, the rest of you. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh my guys. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I am on Gulch. So. 
<laughs> so you guys, so you guys are Onward. Yeah. at the basement. How are you guys getting out? What does the basement look like? Is there just like a door for you to walk out? It was that last map we were on, so there's only one way out. Ah, and then get out the door. through the sewers again. We can always go through the sewers. Damn. We get. Could we get out of the port through the sewers? You guys don't I mean, know. You guys okay, haven't. I was gonna be like. You guys you know, haven't been I in have... the sewers that much. You wouldn't. You got one I was gonna bring Carter knowledge and be like, oh yeah, infrastructure. Of course, they need sewage to be pumped out of the city. Gold doesn't know that. So we have all our stuff back. Uh, back in that great bag of tricks. Yes, you are. Assuming more than welcome I to follow the sewer system. I have a feeling we get lost. We can only stop a small animal from the bag of tricks and see if, uh, you know, he can find the exit. Um, I do have report. my uh, fake mustache and fake ID. Wait, did you get a fake ID? Uh, Mulch Schrodinger? Hello. <laughs> we never got ID cards from Mulch or Hordak. Oh, he hands it to you, it's just drawn in crayon. <laughs> I'm not sure what's worse, the fact that you're in crayon or you said crayon. <laughs> hey, I'm from New England. Let me look. Not pronounced crayon. No, it's crayon. When people say crayon. We also have weird. this automaton thing. Yes, we yeah. do. We have a pet automaton. Yeah. Can some of you guys it? hide inside right. of them? I, I, have, I just put out of my next me there for cooking purposes. Oh, I was just gonna go like this. <laughs> it, uh, it, just, it just NPC them. It would go poof. They're magically <laughs> not counted towards anything. Alright, so he was able to escape. That's <laughs> how he did that. Angel right. bullshit. <laughs> you guys turn around and Saki's yes, gone. Saki's gone. Saki's gone. Saki and Admire. Oh, you took us <laughs> on her. Oh, Saki and Admire gone. They're hidden somewhere. <laughs> they ran away together. Oh man, they took the automaton Saki got with them too. Oh, wait, no, yeah, that's right. Saki did get the automaton. Yeah. 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 I was in control of it. Yeah. My automaton. Bye, <laughs> Bob. <laughs> Alright, I say we stop dicking around and we start. Okay, I did forget there were. Out. I forgot about some things on these maps, so you guys can go ahead. And... Doop, 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 doop. Travel. All right, Gold's just gonna put on a hat and a fake mustache and start walking. Um. Oh wait, hold on. Let me uh. Let me get rid of that wall. Okay. Yeah. Oh, how kind of you. I got you, Bun Bun. Yeah. I also don't have dark vision or anything, front. so that's gonna be fun if we go into the sewers. <laughs> You're on me. I I, I got you. I'm gonna go yes. ahead and give y'all the. Uh... There's lights here, and I don't have a sewer map, so we just continuing on, right? You're yeah. 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 Okay then. Somehow Bun Bun has a riding crop out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> Back and yeah, on the butt with it. Hi -ya. Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! Okay. Alright, I'm gonna take a quick sniff, see if there's anyone coming for us. Okay. 25 perception. Still smell the lack of anyone here. Yeah, you said it was like a hospital. It 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 reminded you of a hospital. It reminded you of a uh, union. Yeah. Okay. Um. <sighs> that's worse. Oh. That's a worse Are description. We, we're, we're talking about living buildings again. Oh boy. Like, cause you you've been in oh, union boy, union, huh? and and they oh have God. that that. <laughs> They they have that sterile I scent. I don't like how. Are you saying we had a living building? You don't want to hear this rabbit person. 
I know. <laughs> but that would be an existential crisis that she's about to have. Uh, she had an existential crisis last time she was told that people were buildings. No, no, no. That's you got it wrong. Corporations oh, are people. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, to the left, we that's the jails, right? Correct. Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. So, what we can do is we go back to the hole in the wall I made, follow the same path I took, hop up where I got out of, and then from there, book it. Okay, so so your way that you have out, out of your cell door, or out of your cell, goes to the sewers. Right, and then I followed the yeah. sewers. Yeah, and you're going to go to that. To the end. Yeah, because the sewers follow the roads, because that's how they work. Um, exactly. So, so you guys are just going back to the road. I mean, I mean it's either. That I'm asking or that because trying... you guys mentioned following the sewers. So, right. Yeah. It's it's either that or we try and walk out the front of this building, and that's not a great idea. Agreed. Yeah. No. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't so like before, that. Idea. Before we head yeah. out, before we, have we too head many out, squishies. <laughs> um, when we get back up top. We kind of have a layout of... Um, shit, Leohorn and I were blindfolded, right? At the entrance of the city? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah right. you so guys... the rest of you guys will you have two, to guide us back. You guys were brought down these sets of stairs, and we're done it. And you know that up these sets of stairs are some hidden underground passageways that interleague throughout the city? Think Disneyland underground tunnels. Right. For, for you know, concept. Get lost that way. Exactly. So, do you guys like my idea so far? Go to Sewers' idea for clarification. Yeah, I mean, Yeah. I like, Sewers is gonna be easy for us. Yeah. And who cares if we smell like shit? We got wizards and people. Hey, press the digitation. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Let's press the digitation. Alright, let's do that. Okay. So you guys go to the sewers. What way are you going? Um, I'm gonna be leading everyone, and I'm gonna take the same path I took last time. Okay. No west. Gulch doesn't know which way is west. No, but Gulch is a very good tracker, and as uh -huh. he was going along, he made little X's on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> With his fingernail. Okay, so you're going back to the city. Through the... I mean, that's our only point yeah. of reference, and then from there, the other guys can direct us back to the exit. Okie dokie. So... I'm going to proc this because nobody else has said anything, but I'm going to assume you guys want to be stealthy. 100%. Okay, because yeah. I'm, I'm not going to be that rude and be like, you guys didn't say you're going stealth. <laughs> you guys Sorry. didn't say stealth. Yeah, you just roll walk initiative. down. You guys just walk um, down. On. I'm not very stealthy. You don't gotta be <laughs> stealthy. You're on me. <laughs> I could just look very cute and distract everybody. Here, go. <laughs> <laughs> where are your, where is your beautiful coat again? He <laughs> 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 deserves it inside your coat. <laughs> Perfect. It's even better than what I was thinking. Little did you know, Gulch is a goat slash werewolf slash marsupial. I'm going to Marsupial. <laughs> Just a bag of holding tight around his waist. <laughs> like a fanny pack. <laughs> fanny pack of holding would be sick. <laughs> Just look like a middle aged dad at Disney. <laughs> Yeah, no, I could technically go in a bag of holding. True. Mm -hmm. you, you don't want to do that. I, no, no, <laughs> I can. He'll be fine. 
I, I will be fine. Twins. We'd be fine. No. If we have to smuggle them, smuggle them across the border, we can do it. Well, see, I know why Cheesy's saying, no, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't say he can't. I said you don't want to do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why? Why? Fuck around and find out. Anyway. <laughs> Yeah, right. Fun plain shape stuff, that's why. Yeah, where's where's that stealth rolls then? Oh shit. <laughs> Do I roll There's my bad. I'm gonna just Your boy on a roll for a nap twenty. Mm -hmm. Easy oh, twenty two. Twenty seven. I had a nap twenty and then I got a five. <laughs> I got a twenty two. Oh poor bum. Okay, natural 20 for 23. Plus wow. three nat 20s. I had to roll at advantage because I had a for, mm -hmm. for a total of 19 and a half. 20. <laughs> My disadvantage roll but it, was a whole box. Average, Woo! so with, with five people, yeah. you kind of get an odd average. <laughs> You're welcome, you guys. It's for bring that average down. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like me in high school. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, he was beautiful. Hey, I'm I got I'm rocking a 4.0 in my master's degree program right now. Fuck yeah, Take that. Hell yeah, but man. I mean, I'm happy you being a beautiful person. Oh, you're too sweet. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just beautiful, not smart. Okay. You're smart in your own special way. Not <laughs> mean. Not in a mean way. As soon as I said it, I'm like, nope. You're like, man, dude, you know, my, bus, you know my bus is always really short. And I man, really they bad. make buses <laughs> that long? Bus. Can yeah. we go through the God, sewers, sorry. please? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look, at least he's not calling himself Ed. God. Are we going up to the street and like, trying to stop the way out of here? I think you feel the full music. <laughs> Yeah, so you guys uh, go to the sewers. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, make your way back up to the city. Uh, before we pop open that manhole, mm -hmm. I'm going to kind of peek it open and look around. Mm -hmm. Another perception <clears throat> check. Yeah. Nat 20, baby, for a 29. On a roll today. Dude, I'm feeling good. Good things happen to good people. Yeah, you don't see anything. All right. I'm going to start pulling people out first, and then I'll come out last. Okay. You're in an I alleyway just off of the main place. road. So, like, the, the entrances are kind of, like, there's outcroppings so that the, the entrance of the sewers doesn't, like, if somebody has to go into it, they don't block the entire road. So there's offshoot and then a ladder up to the to street level. And this, uh, outcropping. See this little half alleyway thing? Nah, damn it, bitch. Uh, as you get, as you come up last, bitch, you hear a, a crack of something. Pieces of roof shingle kind of slip and slide a little bit. How high up is it? No, uh, it's probably a two story building, so 25, 
six feet, something like that. Can I ride my uh, stealth check to jump up there? Sure, you haven't done anything, but after this, you'll have to roll another one. Fair. Because like it, it's your action up. to do, doing stuff, interacting with stuff. Right. I'm going to jump up and land on the roof. Okay. Okay. Is there anyone there sneaking around? Yeah. As you uh, surprise, as you jump up, you see three cloaked figures, and one has kind of like slipped, and you see where the an old roof shingle uh, broke underneath them. And there's this a uh, fuck moment. <laughs> Surprise, motherfuckers! <laughs> As you see them pull out, everyone else pulls out daggers. Your leader, can I can I talk to them? Uh, they certainly do so. Your leader is dead. The city's probably gonna get overrun. I suggest you take your families and flee. Or. We hash it out right now. Your choice. This is me at my most kindest. What kind of check would you like to roll? What is, like is it persuasion or intimidation? Um, my intimidation's a lot better, but at this point, Gulch isn't looking for a fight. I think I'm gonna go persuasion. All right. This is insane. Nat 20 for 21. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to add something else onto this for you then. Uh, just because, like, your streak of nat 20s. You're on your game. You're on point. You, you're hyper aware of everything. You, you notice that even though it's daytime and stuff, and, you know, yeah, people will cowls in the, in the daytime, you know, block out the sun. There's a little bit extra to these cowls in these times as well. And then you notice the red eyes. And the lack of oh. smell. Oh. And they they kind of look back and forth at each other, seriously <laughs> contemplating this. Yeah. Um, cool. um, okay, go there's ahead, go ahead. So at the pause, and it you can tell they're they're You've seen your friends do it. You've just had sending go to you. They're having this very brief telepathic communication. I snap at them. I, um, I, no magic. Stop that. <clears throat> One of them kind of puts their two swords away, kind of like on their back hips. Con consider this part of Madame Valzisa's helping hand then. You should run. The others are be waiting still. Running's the plan. Can you tell madam I kept my end up? And I'm just gonna So are we And I puke up a finger. Did you eat his finger? Yeah, when, okay. when he was uh, saying, like, do you want a hand or a foot? I'm like, oh, Gulch is oh, already I'm... snacking on a finger. I, I zoom, okay. Oh. Azura just kind of gags. I'll message you later about that. Then. Watch this lap. Not on my head, please, not on my head. <laughs> I'll, I'll message you later about that then. Why'd you throw that up? That's gross. Because I don't have his head on me right now, but I have fingers in my belly. Bun Bun, we've been over this. I eat people. <laughs> but you threw it up! To prove to them that I kept my end of the bargain on. What? <laughs> on my head. <laughs> <laughs> As you kind of like look back at them, they're gone. 
I only wanted to dap him up. Right. <laughs> At least they weren't like baddies or anything. But we should definitely look it. And I'm gonna hop back down onto the street. All right, um, as you kind of like turn around to uh, like look where you're jumping and stuff, um, you can see guards coming on the streets. Shit, I'm gonna peg Leo Horn in the head with a copper. <laughs> <laughs> you, can you please rephrase that? <laughs> I'm gonna throw a copper piece at your head. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, Little plunk. I'm adding a copper in my inventory. Thank you. You're welcome. Looks up. And I'm going to signal uh, three bad guys that away. Run. I'm picturing number three, a middle finger pointing the direction, and then. Well, well actually, what I did was I did three fingers, bad guy, I made like a bear claw stance. And I have my left hand out and my right hand skid across it to run. Uh, and quick little nod. And then, uh, I, should we do rooftops or do we want to do on the ground? I'm going to go rooftops. You guys do whatever you can. How high up is this roof, Shiny? Like 20 some odd feet. 25, 26 feet. You need a roof of a second story building. So I can't jump that high, but I'm sure she's gonna climb up. We gonna narrow this? Gonna use my star, starlight step and just go right up there. At least one of them. That's. And one of them. I'm just gonna float. Uh, and I'm just gonna book it. Uh, and we all Naruto run across the rooftops. We're gonna need some yep. some checks for. Hold on, real quick. Uh, let's see this. One, two, three. Four. All right, cool. I am spending two second level spell slots, real quick. Uh, those of us who are running are all getting long strider. You have an extra ten feet of movement. How many people can be? How many people are you hitting with that? So for each spell slot above level one, you can target an additional person. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, so I'm doing myself, Gulch, um, and then second, Hellman, second level is Helmet and Jade. And Jade. Yeah, so that's two second level spell slots for a total of four people. All right. Bun Bun, right. hang on. All right. Can I argue that these, I'm guessing, acrobatics or athletic checks to jump rooftop to rooftop, I don't need to do because technically I can just glide over them because I can fly. You can fly as long as you're staying on buildings that are within that range. Yep. Which I will tell you will not cover the entire distance. Rooftops of heart or yeah, like the ones that cross feet. roads, yeah, major roads. Are there any ropes that connect them? No, my assassins oh. create this shit. <laughs> what I was hoping for. You mean ro ropes that come in 50 foot sections? As you guys start running off at this magically enhanced speed, you guys do see more and more people showing up on the rooftops. Archers up on here that have spotted you. And as you guys come back, 
or like not come back, look back to the last moment. You do see a group of lightly armored guards running on the rooftop and more on the ground as well. She can't get me super fast, fast as possible. Okay, what's everybody's movement speed? Uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, 40 or 70. Depending. What do you mean by depending? Wings or not. Are you using your wings? Not currently, no. I'd say, dude, use your wings. We're trying to flee a country right now. I can only oh, use wow. them once per day. And if I can get away with not long? using them right now, for an hour. This is probably the point to use them. Alright, yeah. fuck them Popping a pair of black mm -hmm. wings. Right. So you're at We're 60? trying to flee from the law. That's a total of 70 feet. 70. Hellman, what's right, your so speed? 40. 40. Because of Leroy. Yep. And Gulch? 85 feet. Uh, average of. gets rounded up 65 feet. Um, so that's gonna be the group's travel speed. Actually, we all... go ahead. Uh, could what were you gonna ask? Might have I was gonna ask about action dash. That would be an act. So we are in a chase. So we'll all we'll take turns back and forth. You guys can elect one person from your team that can use an action. The dash would be an action. Um. Uh... So. We're gonna Would take that action affect everyone or just the individual. It it affects the group, so okay. we're affecting the group. Um, we'll actually, you know, we'll take this as whoever is representing the group who use their speed. That sound good? I'm always a good representative. So he's got the highest speed. <laughs> so as you guys, um, yeah, as I try to only use that once on a rotation. Yes. So in those rules, I'm going to reiterate them now. I tried to make sure you guys had time before session to read them. As I was it's good for it the up. audience to know. Yep. Um, so I tried to give you guys a little bit of heads up time so you could read it before this. Um, put this up so I don't misquote something. Uh, in these chase mechanics, in the setup, the chase has two sides. The characters and you know, the chasers and the runners. Um, we're gonna start this group, so, uh, actually, everyone go ahead and roll a d10. Because we're gonna roll 60, 10 plus 60 feet, and that's the starting gap distance. And because there's six people at this table, including me... Nah, I got a four. A nine. Seven. A ten. I got, got a, a nine. Yep, I heard. Uh, you got a two, Alden? Yeah. I'm doing well on my rolls tonight, guys. I got a three. Hell yeah. All right, so that starts, us, that starts us off at a distance of 95 feet. Uh, the chase nice. is going to be broken into some legs uh, that I get to roll. Okay. And then I get to know what each leg is. It's kind of like an arc or an event where something major happens. Like if you guys roll and something really awesome happens, then we move on to the next leg. Okay. Um, if there is either a total of 200 feet between you and your chasers, where you finish all those legs without being caught, you guys have successfully escaped. Hell yeah. Oh, okay. Um... Each of these legs are about 30 seconds, which you guys know is a decent chunk of time. In in terms of, like, combat mindsets. So... <clears throat> um, in revolving the chase, during each turn, uh, first step is, uh, at the start of each leg, both sides choose one character to represent them. The two characters, you and whichever one I pick of the NPCs, 
make an opposed uh, athletics or uh, an opposed athletics check. Uh, no character can make a second check until all other allies have made a check. And then you may go again. So if you guys point Gulch first, then he can't take another action to represent you guys until everyone else at the table has represented you. And then he can go again. That doesn't mean <clears throat> in the second set, like if you went Gulch, Leohorn, Azura, Hallman, Jaden, you could then go Leohorn, Gulch, Jaden, Azura, Hallman. Because you're, you're, you're in the second second lap of it. Okay. Uh, you could technically have two people, the same person that present twice in a row if they were the last one on the first set and the first one on the second set. But until you complete, until everyone has represented once, nobody can represent a second time, and that's same with on your third time and fourth time, so on. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> it's kind of like, like, we took up the initiative and, like, marked everyone down, and then next round we unmark everyone. You guys can go in whatever order you want, again, because everyone's available to take their second their second action because everyone else has taken their first action. Um, second part. The winning side when uh, Widencer closes the gap uh, by 1d10 feet per 10 feet of movement that they have. So, like, if... Uh, uh, and that's rounded up. So, if... Um, Gulch represents you. He has 85 movement. That means he gets 9d10 movement. That to distance. Does that make sense? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and then the other other team gets that many dice for whatever they move, whatever their movement is. And that's how far they progress. Um, if you uh, rolled an odd check on your athletics check, like if you rolled a, a 25 gulch, then you get to roll on the chase event table. Uh, which, okay. in, on roll 20, I've already punched this in and everything, on the tabs, it's the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... The six tab on the top of the right, over top of like a chat bar. It kind of looks like a newspaper. Roll did I say roll twenty? You did. Oh. You did. In foundries. Why isn't it showing? It don't exist. Oh, I didn't configure on the chat. Oh. Okay. Oh, there it is. All right. Um, so there is a chase event table. You can click on it. And down in the bottom right, it says roll. And I'll just go ahead and click this now. It's going to roll. It's going to roll through all these. And it's going to come up with a result. Six. A single. And this is an example of an effect that could happen. A single or small number of creatures <clears throat> uh, impede the character's progress in a non-violent manner. One or more characters may attempt a skill check to convince them to assist the party or interfere with the, oppo with the uh, opponents. Does that make sense? You guys can do yeah. that. Okay. However, <laughs> if you guys roll, like if Gulch rolls a 26, then I get to roll on the table. And my chasers get to have that result. There are a couple of results in here that do also then call on the consequences table, which you guys can look at as well. There are good and bad things that happen inside there. Some of them are pretty dangerous. Some of them are pretty beneficial. And we repeat this until the chase ends. All right. Anyone have any questions? 
I'll I'll figure it out as we go along. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna go ahead and write a big old 95 here, just because that's where we're at. We're at 95 feet ahead. That's not a bad little start. Nope. Almost halfway there. So as you guys... living on a prayer? <laughs> so as, as we start, which one are you guys going... Who are you guys going to have represent you guys first? I think it should either... What's up, Distal? Hope you guys are having a good day. We're just just entering both of us have good movement. Shiny, how does action dash work in this thing? That would like... be your... Action to affect your thing. Okay. Um, so you would get your dash movement worth of movement that adds on. And that would affect all of us? We would get my that, movement? It affects the party. Yep. And we're at 90 feet right now, right? 95. 95. Mm -hmm. Keep in mind, they get to also roll and affect the distance. Okay. And... If we get to 200 feet, where we escape? Yep, and that, that's after both sides roll. Yeah. Can I do a bonus action as well? Nope, nope. just an action. Okay, you just get action. one action to okay. affect the party. Um, do you guys want me to go first? Yeah, you could go. Yeah, I think the smart terrain just yeah. uh, fastest to slowest. Yeah. I'm going to action dash, give us 170 feet of movement. Okay. So you get 17. Nice. 17 D6. D10. D10s. Mm -hmm. Hundred and three. All right. So on their their representative is going to action cast haste. It's not very sportsmanlike. <laughs> As you guys are littered with, with long striders. So. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we could just move 500 feet at once. Uh, they got 52. That sucks. Um, so, so that's 53 you, on us. You had 100 and, 100 and what? 103. Uh, the roll was 103. Mm -hmm. I have 170 um, some odd. Yes. But that the, the the 170 movement is what affects your D10s to gain a gap distance. Right. Okay. Uh, so we're at a total of 146 feet right now. As as you see, Gulch, you you buckle down, you roll, and I need your uh, athletics check. All right. Another nat 20. For a total of? 33. So odd. Oh, odd. I have so, a plus 13 to athletics. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and roll on that chase events table. So I just open up the table, mm -hmm. and then what do I, how do I On roll? the bottom, it says roll. Oh, there it is. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. You guys are running, and you, you through your force of pure physicality, push yourself further. They, through magic matching up to your magical bullshit, um, proceed as well. You do gain a decent chunk of distance, however. How we do it? Uh, who wants to represent next? I can. Alright. Uh, 
I'd like to actually so that. we're gonna ask oh. we're gonna off first uh, because we did this out of order I need you to make your oh. athletics check um before okay. you roll I have a quick question mm -hmm. so technically Azura has a mount mm -hmm. if Azura were to go would she be using my movement no she's using her movement what if she? Well, if she was on the horse, she'd be using She's the using her. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a good try. It was, but she uses her movement. That's how, it, that's how it works. Because that would be you using your abilities, and you can't affect this until everyone else takes a turn. I see. I got a 21 on the athletics check. 21. Very nice. They will be two on the D20. Um, okay, 21. Well, let's keep the order straight and not jump out of order. Uh, step two, uh, you uh, get to close the gap by a D10. And you're taking your action to dash. So what's your movement? Yes. Uh, that would give me 120 feet of movement. Okay, you get 12 D10. I don't have. Well, I'll good thing you can type it into the chat. I'm gonna do it on Beyond. Bitch! Type it in the fucking chat. No. Yeah, I don't know the command. Forward slash R space. The dice number D. The same exact command for. To be fair, I always do. Uh, letter slash. Letter slash. So I mess it up. Forward too. slash. Each one D ten. R for roll, space, number of dice, D, size of a dice. Yeah, I always type no, it in like I'm on Forward slash E10. R, R for roll. Space 12. Forward slash R for roll space the number of nice. dice D the size of the die. How many how many dice? Just how many dice? This error. Oh, how many know. dice? Twelve D ten. Which slash are you hitting? Like what what other buttons on the key? Uh, it's the one that. Um, what, what other symbols on the key that you're pressing? The question mark. Okay. Don't hit the question mark. It's 85. You can see them raise a spell their speed goes they got 65 And I need you to roll on the chase table. So I just click roll. 
Okay, then. A physical threat represents itself. As you guys are running and you're dashing and pushing yourselves as far as you can, you notice that there's a, um, a roof, root, a loose roof in front of you, and it might collapse if you guys are running there. I need you to roll a d4 first, Jaden. Okay. I need three of you guys to make a deck save. Is yes. it saucy there? No. Yeah. She ran off. <laughs> no? Oh. No, remember she <laughs> ran off with with his with Adamac. Saki Ran Adamai off with in. their boyfriend. I don't remember <laughs> yeah. doing that. Oh, you disappeared. Yeah, so you ran she off did it, man. You did it. No, you guys made it out of the city fine. Question what? for deck what? save. Does the mountain combatant work with that? Yes, so make it a deck. What does it say? So, um, it says if your mount is subjected to an effect that allows it to make a deck saving throw, it takes no damage on a success and half damage on a fail. That's what it does. I also, I also have advantage on deck saves. I have a very, I have a fairly good deck save. I have a plus eight. My I have a plus nine. Only a plus four. That's better than mine. So you guys three do it. Alright. Oh, uh, Azura, real quick. Uh-huh. Before you roll. I have a plus three, but I take it at advantage. So it's up to you. Mm. I think the advantage would work into your advantage. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to tell you what to do, so I just... I just you can roll! Like Alright. <laughs> Do you also get a plus two for being within ten feet of her? I do. Yeah, you do. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's plus five with five. advantage. I got a twenty-five on the deck save. Okay, that passes. Twenty-two. That passes. That is a twenty-nine. That one. No, that one fails. No. <laughs> <laughs> and if I'm within the ten feet, that's a thirty-one. And what level are we? Yep. <laughs> uh, you guys take 14 reduced to 7 bludgeoning damage from okay. uh, I if I actually you, take nothing I'm going to say you take nothing as an Asian. Yep. And Bolt also takes nothing. That is correct. Mm -hmm. Okay, I take 7. Yep. Yo, Azura, we are a team made in heaven. We I know! Everyone needs their personal defense bunny. Alright, who's next? <laughs> Is that all for... Like, is that at the end of, like, my round? Yep. I use the bathroom real quick. Alright. Good job, bathroom boy. We. Boy. Boy. All right, who wants to represent next? Can go next. So how? So we're 163 ahead of them. Yes. Uh, you. You guys do notice that you're coming to a point that you'll have to get off the roofs if you want to continue in this direction. Okay. Um. Our Naruto running has come to an end. <laughs> <laughs> I'm there! Um, well, I guess, yeah, then I'll just action dash. Because my uh, walking speed is 40 feet. 50. Yeah. No, she did not get hit by Lunch Rider. Oh, shit, right. Us yeah, no, she just yeah. mounted. Because <sighs> we all yeah. assumed she would use her mount speed. Yep. Well, unfortunately, her mount already affected the party. As per the feat she took, shiny. <laughs> All that feat does is the de is the saves. <laughs> no, it also gives me advantage uh, on attack rolls. On, yeah, against non-mounted. Yeah. 
and I, I don't mean to sidetrack us. And does that feat allow you to have any attack that hits you? Target no, your that's mount? It's that's the other the, way uh, around. That's uh, yeah. That one's the uh, the fighter cab cavalier. Cavalier, yeah. And like yeah. thirteen yeah. or this something, I think. Yeah, this yeah. one's the other way around, where I can force an attack targeted at my mount to target me instead. Yeah, don't do that. I'm don't hurt yourself. <laughs> Okay, so. So how where where are you running? Because you're gonna have to figure out where you're going. Because we're. We're gonna have to slide down one of the drain pipes. The entire party. <laughs> right, so you yeah. got. Nin you know, like in the movies where you like jump and then you grab drain pipe and you just. Slide oh down yeah, the yeah, that's exactly how. We're this all works. mirror's edge in here. <laughs> mirror's edge here, yeah, with invincible drain pipes for no fucking reason. <laughs> I mean, at least Azura could do that. Azura could easily ride down the drain pipe <laughs> until her hands hits that first bracket and they go bam right under their hands. Would any of us be able to use reactions while this is going nope. on? Shiny. Nope. Only actions. Okay. Representative. So as you guys okay. come up to the end, what is your what is your action? Considering you will have you will have to get off of the roof. I'll ask that. I'll clarify Ooh. that in case you. I was gonna say I would have to get. You could down. have. Is there any? Um, you could have any... Leohorn do it. Could have Leohorn. And that could be his but action, that, but... But then that would use his action for his turn, right? As representative? As representative. It's, it's why I'm asking. Are you trying to help us or are we to the walls of the city? Yeah. Uh, you are not at the number of legs and you are not 200 feet away. Distance away. Okay. Uh, if I can still get a rough number. I don't, uh, no. We're running. Right, we're we're running through the fucking city. We are running through the fucking city. The distance is irrelevant. You're not at the walls. <laughs> you don't know. Okay, the Billy answer is Joe. you don't know. The representative of California Thank has you. the floor. <laughs> um, are there any of the little shop, like, canopy things on any of the buildings? Mm-hmm. So you can use that to hop down? Mm-hmm, absolutely. Yeah, I'll do Because that. they're trampolines. As we're running. Yeah. They're super strength trampolines. Assassin's Creed taught me anything. Yeah, well, we're gonna, that's how we're gonna get down. We're gonna jump down via so, canopy. So, are you. It totally won't rip. Who's taking the action? Me! Okay. So, what's your action to get off the second story rooftops? Like, describe it wise? What's or your action just... you're taking? The action I'm taking is, is a dash. Is... Okay, so you're not. You're not alleviating the 25-foot fall you're taking. Uh, because I'm her mount, can I take that damage? No. I mean, I can jump 15 feet. Like, I have the rabbit's luck. Uh, mm -hmm. but, but you're so still you're getting... falling 25 feet. But I'm landing on a canopy first. Absolutely. So that's half of it. Absolutely, positively. Are you locking that in? I already told you I was jumping onto a canopy and then onto the floor, so that's half. No. Because we're not. I was... in, we're not in rush hour. Um, yeah. you don't know that. It's seven thirty where I. No, I'm. I very. I very specifically know where we are. <laughs> in fact, it's I'm the one that. It's six o'clock right now. I'm the one that <laughs> said where we are. You said that there were little shop canopies that we can jump Cheesy. down off of. Cheesy. You're gonna go straight through that canopy. Azura's not gonna go straight through that canopy. Do you mean the one that's riding yeah, because gulch? Because apparently I'm, she's not mounted. No, because <laughs> if I was her mount, I would be taking the damage. Well, yeah. they're all taking the damage, specifically. 
what I have to because I've got my wings out flying. The flying people are not. The not flying people are going to take the fall damage. If I take double fall damage, can Cheesy not take fall damage? No, because she can't invert your damage. Then what's the point of the feet? Oh my gods. Hey, Cheesy, can I take lead on this turn? Yeah, yeah, take it. All right, cool. We're going to run right off the edge. What you mean I'm being difficult? No, you're a difficult you're not man. Being difficult. No, everything you think is pretty reasonable. So yeah, we're gonna run off the edge of this building, Featherfall. Okay, I need a full-on cartoon. We don't look down. You should make your athletics check first. Why the right. coyote this shit? That is a uh, athletics nineteen. Okay, they did not fail, so you do get your action. Boot. So your action is the so, Featherfall. Yep. Adverting the damage. Orange. So what's your movement? 80? 70. Uh, 70. 80, 70. You get 70, 10. Uh, 7. As you guys further fall down, you you see the ones that are on top of the roof get left behind as they start crawling down and making their way way over. However, you do see the the attachment of ground foist people, specifically those on horses, because the people in knights can't keep up with you. The ones in armor can't keep up with you. You still. So they have horses. They have nanas. They have nanas. Um, they got. They got 35. Neat. We gained three feet. Mm-hmm. All right. Chase event table, I take it. Uh, you had an odd odd check, right? Si, senor. Si, then. A physical obstruction appears. One character. Sure. Must make an appropriate check to subvert it. Uh, as you guys are running here, you see a large crowd of people. Uh, hey, Gulch, what's your intimidation? <laughs> uh, my intimidation is plus five. How is mine higher than yours? Because you're because charisma I have a charisma. Because <laughs> you're a bard. <laughs> Fair. Yeah, that, that's accurate. <laughs> You're a bard I who took people to intimidate them. <laughs> so we Lior. can't stop and eat people right now. <laughs> Which, who are you going to have take an action? Which, at this point, Saki, you can show up. Saki, fire your gun. Bat! Fires a gun. Okay. Just in the air. In the air. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead and take make an advantage <laughs> check at... Or an, uh, advantage check. And an, intimidation. an intimidation check at advantage. Me or Saki? The one firing the gun. It, okay, I'm just making sure. So, Adam, I. <laughs> <laughs> I get a plus two. <laughs> well, you get advantage. Yeah. I got a 16. Yeah, it makes makes way so that the next person does not have half distance. So you manage to, to clear the crowd enough for whoever's next gun represent the party. And she comes bolting out from a side alley. <laughs> Run it. Oh, shit. What's it? The, there's a... It's one of those like claymation art style games where he's running and he has the gun and he's just swinging it left or right. <laughs> God, I wish I could. God, I can. I can picture the game. I just can't think of the name. <laughs> anyway, 
Uh, who's gonna run from the horses next? Question. Yes. Has there been a short rest since the fight? No. Okay. Okay, the monk's gone. Leo's gone. Gulch is gone. Azura is gone. Mm -hmm. So it's just us two. No, Azura is uh, not gone. No. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Um. So are you are you gonna take are you gonna represent him? Um uh, unless Tiger wants to It's um, it's it's you, Halden, and Azura that can have an option. Yeah, unless Wizard Boy has some speed stuff to do. I get no I'm just running. <laughs> I have no major speed stuff to do and the one thing I can't do is a bonus action and not an action. There's difference. <laughs> well, you use a bonus action if that's your one thing you're doing. Yeah, you can use a bonus action oh. as an action, but you cannot use an action as a bonus action. Well, in, in oh. technically, no, yeah. not in initiative or yeah. anything, but in this case, but you can use a bonus action. This case. You can do a oh, thing. Can you can do a single yeah. thing. Okay. It would only affect me, though. This is... Well, it's what you're doing. It, it affects the party. Oh, it affects the party if I do it? Oh, yeah. I'll do You're representing thing. the party, so we're going up with you. Okay, Cause, do we cause if we the were... athletics check still? Because if we were... Yeah, that determines if you get your action. Um, okay. Because if we were traveling, you know, if we were doing... But it affects everyone, we'd be going off at your speed because you were the slowest. But we, but the entire party moves and acts as if that one person is represented. Uh, that is a 22. Acrobatics, right? Athletics. Athletics. Oh, athletics. Oh, oh well, I found the real time. Uh... It's a 23. Oh, that's 11. Right. Uh... So you just get your movement. And you don't get a... You don't get to add an action to your turn. No, I don't get to add an action to my turn. Nope, but what's your movement? 40? Uh, 40, yeah. Long Strider? Get 4d10. Yeah. Yay, 4d10. Yeah. Hey. That's a 25. Uh, they got a 43. Of course they did. I'm slowing the party down. As you guys go through, you you got startled a little bit by the gunshots, and as it goes off, <laughs> um, you're like, "Oh shit, Saki!" And you hold on, you hesitate for that split second, as you're like, "Oh, well, at least we found one." But where the fuck's Angel Boy? And and they manage to gain a little bit of that distance. So we're down to Halted and Nazura. No, I already just went. Oh, I'm sorry. You're down to. Saki and Azura. Saki and yeah. Azura. Yeah. I do have a question about yes. the Shield Guardian and uh -huh. How does the Shield Guardian appear? He's, like, he's running behind like you. Okay, okay. Mm. I was gonna say, does it move? Because what if you just summon it and it just blocks the That's path? Bad. It's like, <laughs> run straight into it. Speed. So like I assume it physically walks somewhere. Oh yeah, yeah. No, it. It. it Am I doing too? No, but it's following the amulet for the purposes okay. of the okay. it. <laughs> it. It's <laughs> casually. It's not here, but it's. 
meandering. It's following it's... the amulet, not me. Yeah, and it's it's, it's making its way. It's Make making its moseying along. Yeah. Okay. So not that. Yeah, I've just got running. Okay. So um, athletic. Correct. Check. Um. Look. Mm. That's a sixteen. Uh. 19. Would have rather have been acrobatics. <laughs> well, unfortunately, it's athletics because you're running through the city. I know. Okay, so just uh, walking speed. Uh, 1d10 for each 10 feet of movement you have rounded up. Do, do, boop, boop, roll. They got 52. I got 12. <laughs> Because mm. I don't get an action right to like dash. Correct. They rolled so well finally against the two lower athletic. The two people with no. <laughs> they, yeah, they rolled a one, a two, a four, and a three before you. On like on the d20. I'm almost back where we started. <laughs> don't worry, we'll get out of this. All right, uh, that's everyone, right? Cheesy. Oh, oh, cheesy. Me. I keep forgetting it's you because you started off a turn. Okay. Cheesy, I would like an athletics check for you. Oh, tired. An athletics check. Uh, it's a 19. Oh, that's not good. Well, she got an 8. Well, roll your movement. Okay, that's 4 d10? You have a 40 movement? Yes, I do. Uh, yeah, and it is. Hell yeah, brother. They got a 33. Don't forget the discreet includes Leahorn's up. That, that includes it. She does not have okay. Longstrider. So now, because we thought that she was going to be riding him like a horse. We thought. 27. You're wrong. Fuck yeah, Cheesy. As you guys are down here, the horses are slowly making their movements faster and faster and faster, getting a little bit closer. They're still over 100 feet away. And that's that's round one. Okay. You'll never catch us. We're made out of Every, Round two. Everyone is available for round two. I can start off round two. Okay. What do I do again? Action dash? Uh, athletics check. Twenty. Excuse me, sorry. Uh, twenty-eight. You get an action, this, sir. Um, no, that's part of movement, and I only have one action during this chase, right? Yes. Okay, because I was thinking... No, never mind. Okay, so how, what do I roll again? Sorry. <clears throat> you have an action. You get a... Yep. A d10 action for dash. your movement. Okay, how many d10 again? One d10 per movement. Per every 10 feet of movement. You gotta do math. How <laughs> dare. So that's 17 d10. Ninety-two. I got thirty-nine. So, so, so. Went up to one hundred and fifty-five. And then I roll on the chase event. Okay. Oh, that's right. That's what I was forgetting. Fun. Okay. A physical obstruction appears, and one character. As you're Must running, make... let's make an appropriate check. Yes. As this is coming through, as you're running through these through the streets, 
have been most, mostly cleared out, uh, you see a cart kind of come up and kind of block your path. So I can either jump over it or I can juggernaut through it. <laughs> I would try oh, to juggernaut, jump over it. Oh <laughs> Oh, what about the people? <laughs> the people oh, around you. Be yeah, there's the people around you. There are people. I was thinking like the Cabbage Man from Avatar. I thought it was that kind of cart, but there's people in the cart. I don't want to kill them. <laughs> I mean, you don't know who's in the cart. You just know it's a big old cart. Are there nobles in the cart? You don't know. If like there are, they must die. We talk like carriage cart. Make a perception check really quick. Just Gulch. He's the one doing it. Twenty-seven. This is this is uh, a uh, a tarped cart, kind of like if you think of like a like a the the Oregon Trail game. You know, has that that uh, that leather binding that covers the whole thing. There's at okay. least so no. There's at least one person sitting in front guiding the cart. Okay. So there so could noble, be people inside. Yeah, nobles would never take that cart. They'd have no. the fancy schmancy cart. So we're just gonna jump over it. Okay, right, I thought sure. Uh, can I use my satyr stuff? Sure. All right. So that is. Because it's not an action to do it, it's just something you can do, right? Correct. Yeah. So it'd be an athletics check. Because it asks you to make a check. Oh, so I'm just doing athletics check? Yeah. Okay. Because I'm but, like, all right, yeah, but your I'm ability, at a 69 like, right now. Yeah, because your movement's like, I mean, your ability's like lower to DC. Okay, so I'm just going to do athletics check. Mm -hmm. That is... Plus a D8. 35. Absolutely. Beautiful. Kids in the street go, whoa, oh, man. And clap. <laughs> you like strike a pose, but saying some as I'm take, jumping, kids take finger guns. Goat, man. <laughs> I shout, seize the means of production, land, and keep running. With uh -huh. with like a bunny hanging onto like your like like a mini coat or a mini do cloak. Do three sixty with before you do the finger guns. <laughs> yeah. And you go yeah. pew, pew 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 to like each kid. <laughs> Seize the means of production. Stay in school. Question authority. Land. Run. Slow mo zoom in mid jump with the wink. <laughs> <laughs> Azura pops on some sick black shades. <laughs> looking looking yes. like the bunny in uh, Zootopia. <laughs> Hell yeah. Put some respect on Judy Hop's name, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, who do you guys want to represent next? Go for it. Great. Athletics. Here we go. A natural 20 for a 25. Hell yeah. Uh, I can possibly beat that. With a 26. Natural 20 as well. Oh. I will only get close. I can beat it, but not quite. Um, I got it. Um. Well, so, am I 30 feet from Azura? Does that apply to only saves? Or it, it saves. Ah. What's your movement, okay. though, so? But my movement is 60. Is 
using a key point in action? Correct, it is. Because because you're gonna do step of the wind, which is a thing you're going to do. Okay. Which you don't get to do because they beat you. Okay. They got uh, a yeah, the six eight. eight. So then roll your six d ten. Thirty-seven. Uh, you guys, what? This is how much it changed. Kaput. <laughs> Just went down one point. They got a. They got a total of thirty-eight. <laughs> um. All right. Uh, roll on the uh, the table. Take an action to assist the side of <clears throat> side or act they... against the opposing side, providing they declare their. Oh yeah, that I I started deleting that halfway. I didn't like that. Uh, roll a d4 for me, Jaden. Uh, you and somebody else that you pick. I'm gonna change it to that because that's what I started changing to. I just missed that one apparently. And it's just move an act. You get to use an action to assist their side to act against the opposing side. And I pick. I can't pick Gulch, can I? No, you can. You can always pick me. Yeah. You can for this one, yeah. Okay, so. Gulch, if I pick you, do you just want to do both of us to use action dash? You've, Hell as, yeah. as of notice point, we've already rolled for the, what we're doing for our movements. So this is an actual action. I'm kind of like, oh. And we're being chased by horses? People on war horses, yeah. Now, stay with me on this. Oh no. Shenanigans is gonna happen. Nothing good begins that way. We got, we came out of the sewers, right? And then used press of digitation. Mm -hmm. That's fine. That's cool. That's cool. Are there manholes? At the sewers, sewers, yeah, that you did not grab. Are there any manholes in this street that we're running through to help with irrigation? I'm going to answer your question with a question. Are you going to divert from running in a straight line at your full speed to try and go grab something else? I want to stay in my straight line, and if there's any sewer grates or manholes, I would like to grab one and throw you one at like the horse's to, ankles. You would like to stop running to grab something and try and rip it out the stop. It's on the fly. Denied. You know, just uh, casually... I think we just both... I think we both just action that. You're... The dash will not affect this. Dash won't affect this? No, we, we've already done the the movement. It we're our past the okay. movement rolls. Alright. So... You wanna throw a block of incest incense at their uh, <laughs> ankles? I got one of those. I have, I have a javelin. A have or a javelin. <laughs> As uh... I'm running, I would not like to stop. I don't want to stop. I would like to chuck a javelin at a horse. Okay, make it front. A, you can make an attack roll. I rolled and then I just stared at the word javelin and I'm like, what now? <laughs> um, uh, 25 to hit. Okay, that hits. And I would like to throw I it think... at its leg. It will not hit that. Because it gets an AC buff for the leg. Fine. Just at the rider. Okay. Anything to make something stumble and fall at the head of the pack. Are you aiming at the rider or the horse? 
what has the lower AC? <laughs> you don't know now. Which one are you aiming at? The, <laughs> the horse, horse hits. You okay. aimed at the horse. It hits the horse. All right. Now what? Roll. What happens after you roll the hit? You hit something. Um, they fall down. <laughs> roll your damage. <laughs> dramatic answer <laughs> fashion. Creating a pile up. Roll your damage. The horse does have an HP bar. Ten points of damage. Is unfortunately not enough to knock the horse out, but it is marked. Fair enough, I guess. With a javelin <sighs> sticking out of it. Yeah. Good luck taking tight turns with a ten foot pole sticking out of you. <laughs> <laughs> and I make a perception check to see if there's anything that can block the path behind us. Okay. That will set up whoever next takes an action. That would be my action? Be yes. Okay. So you could do maybe, that to like, maybe do that at the end of the round? That's the end of the that's the end of his turn. Is this this is the end of it. We've so already what's, rolled uh, movement. This we've already rolled stuff. movement. Oh, this is extra stuff. Sorry, I went downstairs to get a glass of water. I, I wanna You're cast I wanna cast shatter on something. That will fall and block our path a little bit. If, if not all the way, just a little bit. Enough to obscure their movement. Okay. If you do, okay, that will. Okay, you can cast Shatter or something. Go ahead and roll damage for it. Because I'm assuming you're. There's stuff in here. You can pick something. You cast Shatter on the same horse. <laughs> cast Shatter on Make that horse. 17 points of damage. <laughs> Jesus fuck. Are you going to cast it on the horse because it got mentioned? I cast it on the horse. Well, that no, it's. A... Oh wait, 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 <laughs> wait, wait! I just, I just realized this. That's what I just realized. Gulch, how far can? What's your range on on javelins? Um, I gotta find the javelin again. It's um, 120 feet. It's unfortunately not 154 feet. Good luck dodging a spike in the road, I guess. <laughs> okay. <laughs> At least five of the horses are going down. <laughs> I, I just want to cast it on something that's going to block our, uh, our path. Ooh, what if... The cart we jumped over. <laughs> <laughs> the cart. Those poor people inside. Ah, we finally made it. 150 days of travel. Yeah, Boom. honestly, I cast, I cast Shatter on the cart. Cast it on oh, the no. cart! All right, go ahead and roll no. your damage. Coming from the guy who oh, would... It, it, was, it was 17, it was 17 points of damage. Wait, 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 wait. Can I just say something real quick? Sure. What if you cast Shatter on the ground and make a crater? Horses aren't great with craters. Yeah, the ground underneath the cart. <laughs> It's like an I'm airbag. I made it to the city to find yeah, medicine yeah, for my sick boy. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> on the ground yeah, underneath the cart, it's like it. an it's like an yeah. airbag. When you watch people like sing it, sit down on airbags, he goes. <laughs> Real talk. Real talk. You refuse to kill a noble man <laughs> accused of war you, crimes, but you you're going to blow up civilians. You refuse be, to fight a noble. Alone. Make that make, that make sense. You refuse. Baby boy, make that make sense. Yeah, you harassed him and you have corrupted him. Congratulations, this is the monster you made. Yep. <sighs> That's not how that. Start doing. Shut up. <laughs> Like, what laws are you, guys, you going by? <laughs> you wanted him to break guys, the laws. He has broken you, laws. You guys see Gulch throw this javelin and it land on the ground and Jade just... Jade just turns around, turns his hand around, and all you guys see is the cart just... Boom! And it fucking cast shatter on the cart and you hear this giant crack of thunder and you always just look all at Jade and he goes, Fuck, leave me alone! <laughs> you. The you. production does not mean war crimes. <laughs> the rest of the party, you just see like everyone, face Paul just. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm improvising. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, bad improviser. 
Luckily, uh, the guy got off the cart, and there were no. The guy goes there. flying, screaming for his life. Boxes and shit go oh, flying. No, I'm you dead. <laughs> My cabbages. I was about to yell. Leo Horn, feather fall him quick. Out of range. Out of range. No. <laughs> <laughs> He's all he is the Wilhelm scream in the background. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, right. Does <laughs> he scream? Ooh. 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 Uh, there is mass right. panic in the streets now. Uh, Jesus Christ. Behind us. <laughs> yeah, behind you. Behind us. <laughs> in front of the horses. Uh, Gulch and Jaden are out. Who's next? Jesus Christ, it's Jason Bourne. <laughs> <laughs> if you're alright with it, Azura, I can pop up next. Sure. Alright. Now, this is a general observation question, Shai. Do I see the city wall? No, you're on the ground street, you see buildings and roads. Okay. Would I be able to say there's roughly 500 feet in front of me? No. No? Okay. If you can see a road coming up, maybe about 300. 300? Okay. I and mean, we'll look, the road... These... Sorry, I said bad words. Uh, the, the road ends into, like, a T in, like, 300. All right. Well, it ends into a T in about 300, and then I take it some buildings are kind of there in the way. Mm-hmm. Okay. You need to do athletics check first. Yep. That is a 18 plus the athletics, which is 5, 90. which is 23. Alright, you get your action. Woot. Um, I'm going to cast Dimension Door. Mm -hmm. 300 feet forward, and then... Uh, the rest of the feet, you know, going up to put us on top of the uh, rooftop. Mm -hmm. It's still about 300 feet, but then, you know, at that distance, yeah. 25 feet di vertically isn't that much different of a... Uh, yeah. It, well, it's not. It's just specifying but, yeah. because how the spell's worded. Because I'm totally like, get 500 feet of movement with that. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I'll cast a mention door and then run us through the door. <laughs> Chat. War rhymes! <laughs> 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 what's, what's the limit on people for that spell, Leo? Mm -hmm. You and one other person. Uh -huh. So who are you taking out of, out of the chase? <sighs> Take the person that's gonna fail to do most of his, his action. Ah. <laughs> uh, oh, <sighs> Damn. All right. Well, you know, I was hoping that would work, but alas, it did not work. That would not work. All right. Well, what is compulsion do again? I don't know. I can't set a range for that. That's disappointing. Oh, wait a minute. You could you could move and then fireball the the what's left of the, the carriage. No. no. Why are we still destroying the carriage? <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> We're past it! We're past that! <laughs> We're Petticoat, too far now. Yes. <laughs> We're too far now. He hasn't moved yet. He hasn't rolled his movement. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Oh shit, I don't have that prepared, oh. so I can't use that. I can use the door terrain, so I can't do that. So, action dash. Alright, Leohorn. What's up? Um, Saki's here. Right? So, Steel Defender's here. No. The Steel what? Defender is casually walking in the direction we, of the we amulet. We, we did communicate The amulet earlier. is not attuned. So does that mean he's stuck inside just smacking the door? No, he's casually he walking. Or does he have the, uh, the thought capacity to be able to open said door? <laughs> the doors that you guys opened? The shield guardian is slowly making his way separate of us. Yes. I was just thinking in a straight line, because that would... I didn't say anything about a straight line. 
I feel like, like I don't know how many kills. He didn't go in a straight line, was my point. So is he just like, oh, he's going oh crazy. the he has, is this way. He has the NPC tracking him. greater than 1992. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, one second. I just need to locate one last D10. I forgot this. I didn't have a D10 in it. Fuck, I'll use a D100. Same concept. No. Or, uh, okay. or you could type in Foundry. Or, or, I can just grab my metal dice that also have the D10s with them. No, we definitely don't want to show the audience what you're rolling. I know. What's your movement? Uh, 70 with action dash. So 140. Oh, okay. I was like, what the fuck you getting that? Was that? Yeah. Hey, that is 215. Because. In the 8d6, 8d10 that they rolled, they rolled five ones. Jesus. <laughs> Get <laughs> <shwet>. <laughs> <laughs> I just sat there, Holy I look at him like, you have 8d10 and you rolled a total of fucking 14? Those guys would be let go from their jobs. I know. I know this is like, Jesus. It's the shatter. The horses stopped. It's the, the shatter. <laughs> the, war, <laughs> the war horses got fucked up by the war crimes you guys did to the civilians. Oh. I, I love how we committed war crimes. It's like, congratulate if I said the cast one person, someone else, and I get shit. Fuck guys. No, literally. No, we're not. We're uh, not yeah. happy. No, no. The, war crimes the horses were gaining on y'all, and then yeah. you you jumped over a carriage, blew it up, and then escaped. Listen, <laughs> it was not the lawful good character Azura that chose. Mm -hmm. To blow up the cart. <laughs> hey, Lehart, go ahead and roll that on that. Yeah. Roll on that table one more time. Just, just as the last little. Bit of, of course. I'm fine with blowing up horses, but not the proletariat. The, the, the cooler, magical obstruction appears. Go with acrobatics or athletics check to avoid the obstruction. Hold the up, bell. hold up. I got this. I got this. As yeah. you, as you dash past it, you see another carriage. At full speed, yelling, BROTHER! Oh. Okay. Can I- Can I choose to rage and jump this shiny? Uh, you guys got past it. Uh, <laughs> you broke the distance. Hi! BROTHER! Who the fuck was that guy? BROTHER! You guys managed yeah, to. going to be haunting Jaden's dreams forever now. <laughs> Blowing up a cart, hurting civilians. I don't think we should stop running until nightfall hits. Just so, saying. I feel like we should avoid main road. As you guys run past this, they come around the corner. The wall comes 
up to you. Because you reached your 200 foot distance. Um, how are you guys getting past this wall? Are we talking about the big, thick, green one? No, the, 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 the castle walls. Or not castle, the, oh, okay. the city walls. How tall are the city walls? Ooh, them big boys. 50 feet. 50 feet? Easy. Easy. Mm-hmm. Uh, if there's uh, a little crack in the wall, is there I can just smush through there? There's like a gulch, golden hole. Gulch spikes Zura through the wall. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you guys run up to a big old gate. Gulch perfect spirals Zura through the gate. What is everyone else doing? <laughs> uh, you're riding gulch. Yeah, I am riding gulch. So you hey, can there's a the gate wall. in front of us. Did, no, yeah. that was that was the thing. You gotta come oh, up to a wall. Is, is there an Assassin's Creed route going up? No, because it's the city walls. Hey, Saki, so no. you, you wanna you want you wanna get princess carried over the wall? You no, know, most of the time they don't they don't like it when people are near the defensive walls. So no. Yeah, but it's on the inside. No. Shiny, you have a question. Mm -hmm. So, I'm Azura's male. Mm -hmm. If I fall, is she gonna take damage or just me? She'll take half damage. Because if you're in a car, and because if you're riding in a car and you hit a wall, it still hurts. Nah, I just squeeze my butt real quick and I jump a little bit. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> because if you're in an elevator and the elevator that you're mounted in, when it hits the bottom, you still you still break your legs. Um, no, you're fine. That's how you're physics works. Like you <laughs> jump at the last split second. All right. Uh, and then you hit your head at the top and get a concussion. Get a concussion, exactly. pass out, you go limp, and then you ragdoll on the floor and you're fine because you ragdolled. Exactly. <laughs> and that's why it's recommended you just lie on the floor if you elevator starts plummeting actually look you didn't That's die true. from more the ground surface area for the energy to go through. yeah um, hey, you didn't die trash. from the you're landing more likely to fall upwards rather than anyway down. anyway can, anyway. I, can anyway. I jump the wall can you jump that far uh my high jump is 34 feet plus a d8 plus an athletics check roll it oh let's do this <laughs> oh wait do you want <laughs> Do you want me to cash? Um, hold on. Okay. He has to roll like a five, I think. Basically. Okay. Otherwise, I, I have something to give you. Advantage. Well, let's see what the roll is, and then. <laughs> do you do you have to give him it before That's not or how after? That works. Do you have to give him it before, or is this a reaction to him making a check? I was gonna use the enhance ability spell. That's yeah, still have a chance to cast before. Yes, I know. That's why I said to you on yeah. the floor. Or... <laughs> but if you only need a five, then I'll say. For Wait, sure. what? What is your high jump? High jump is thirty-four feet plus D eight plus athletics check. So thirty-four plus thirteen. Yeah. Forty-seven plus at least one. So you have to roll a three. So that's. So you can add your entire athletics check? Yes. yes. What's yes. what do you get that from? So the D8 is from being a satyr. The uh -huh. athletics check is beast barbarian. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And I think that's dope. level seven. Yeah. Yeah. Sean's not there yet, but I I know this build. <laughs> Death Knights. Yeah, it, your entire athletics check. All right, go ahead. So it jumps 70 feet in the air. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, and on top of the wall, be like, hang on tight, and I jump off so the wall. So you jump 70 oh my feet. God. Okay, so you jump up to 50. So you manage to jump up. How do you get down safely? Um superhero three-point landing all right so you're taking 5d6 damage 
That's cool. I'm cool with that. And then I jump off the wall. And you make a dex save. Yeah! Remember, plus two on dex saves. <laughs> and then... And the other thing, because you're my mount. What's the other thing? The other thing is if you are successful, Evasion. you take no damage. And if you fail, you only take half damage. Awesome. 22 dex save. Okay. To be clear, Cheesy, the damage is not based on the save. He takes the damage regardless. It's whether or not he's prone is what that is. What do you mean whether or not? It doesn't it, stick prone. When you f- no, no, when no. you fall, your deck save uh, is whether or not you fall prone or not. Got you. Uh, so what was your save, Dolch? 22. Okay. You are still in your two feet hero pose. You take... 21 bludgeoning damage and GZ takes 10. Nice. That's fine. Hell yeah. I'm cool with that. Alright, what's next? Flyboy fly over? Yeah, who wants uh, Princess carried over the wall? Before I say yes, is there, there's no way for me to use ac- ac- acrobatics to climb a 50 foot wall? In any expedited movement? No. Uh, you gotta make it for each movement. I got nothing. <laughs> I can, I could carry Saki over the wall. I should carry Cass. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure. Go to your inventory. Go to your find that out. Inventory. Click, Click on, on weight carry. Click on weight carry. Mm-hmm. At the top of your inventory, you should see uh, some weights. Top left of Very capacity is 180 pounds. With and how much gear I, do you have on you? Like, what's how much weight are you carrying? Uh, enough for it to matter. Mm-hmm. Saki, Saki, Saki's carrying 105 oh. pounds plus however much he weighs. Oh, or 100 and a half. So that's like 200 and some cha- and, and more. Yeah, and some, it's, uh, it's like 260, 270? Something like that. Plus whatever he's carrying. So that that's over his... 300? How much does... Uh, Hellman? Hellman weigh? How much do I weigh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> from the edge thinking <laughs> just to <laughs> Almond strikes uh, me as someone who's like 150 pounds wet because that's my carriage capacity is 150 well how much do you how weigh? how much the fuck? <laughs> come up with a weight uh, how heavy is he? 130 I'm gonna I say gonna... He, he's small uh, I was gonna say like 120, maybe. Yeah, I would say so. He, he yeah. looked like a scrawny boy. He's definitely not spoiled or anything. Uh, I had a way to get off the shiny little. Are you, are you guys. They're both bonus actions, but that's it. We're not in an issue. What you doing? Uh, I wanted oh. to try to use Starlet Step with my vampire fist, because I have no points for that. Mm-hmm. Are you gonna show him that? Oh, yeah. He should. <laughs> 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 Are you gonna so show him that? That's the that. question. <laughs> Everyone just goes, "The fuck did he just say?" <laughs> he was the fuck out of me, sir. <laughs> you don't know nothing. Quick. You don't so, know well. so, so he hasn't. Think we're gonna do Starlet. He did some sanguimancy stuff. He did right? do sanguimancy. Yeah. So yeah. I basically point to a point, whatever, do thirty feet of Starlet step, and then you see him turn into like a mist of shadow just like disappear and go further up the wall. So the answer was yes, he is going to show us that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright. And then I reached the top basically. With, like, there's, like, Alright, so you, you, you got to the top. Arcana right. checks. Sure, yeah. I don't know what the fuck that is. We just saw a man turn into misty shadows. I got a Oh, I thought that was a one. That's a total of nine. Zuri, you don't see this. You're on the other side of the wall. Oh, I'm already on the other side of the wall. Yep, you guys. It's a 19. You guys went first. 
basically only Jaden, Leo Horgan, and um, Saki can make an Arcana check. Mm -hmm. yeah. Dirty 20. Dirty 20. I feel like either way, Azura would just not know. Um, you guys, uh, <laughs> Azura would just not, not know. Uh, Jaden and Leo Horn, you both, um, you, you had questions when you started pulling out some blood shit in his magic in the big fight. Um, but you decided to hold off on that later. This feels different than the blood magic he did before. Topic for later. Let's go, Leo. Yeah, too many people for problems. All right. Uh, Let's go, Leo. You can still hear the chase in the background looking for you, but they have lost you. And this is still, like, your... This is everyone's, like, thing they're doing, so even though we're taking time figuring out what everyone's doing, this is still a boom-boom-boom thing. You want to go Let's over or through? Over there. I would like to be on the other side. All right, um, Okay. And you know what? I'll see you guys be, over there. I want to cast anyway, so Dimension Door, we're going through the door, to the wall. Yay. Dimension through, through, the, through the wall? Alright. Through the uh, wall. Jaden, how are you getting up now? Flying. Flying. Yep. You have enough flying movement. Uh, Hallman, how are you getting down off the wall on the other side? Would you allow me to use my last two starlet steps? Sure. <laughs> it's not just, it's not a one-time thing, so yeah, you, you can keep using it. Yeah, also, true. I, I don't know if my uh, my fly movement makes me go all the way down to the other side, but I do have slow ball. Yeah, I was going to say, you got slow ball, that's why I wasn't asking you how you get down. You want to roll it? Uh, what's your movement? Slow fall? Yeah, what's what's your uh, total movement when you're in fly? Uh, right now it's still 60. 60? Okay. Uh, that'll get you up and over, but you still have down. Um, yeah. so it's still 5d10 and you can remove. Or 5d6. Uh, My bad. Um, can reduce. It's 18, fall. which I think... Yeah. Your reaction... Mm -hmm. Okay. Fall to reduce any fall damage you take by fifty. Yeah, I'm like it's it's not even gonna be close. Um, yeah, you you just poop and you you stop flying just as you get over the the walls and you guys are so quick that the guards didn't have time to uh, grab you. Find it. And you're on the other side of the wall. Uh, they're probably going to be able to get one shot off at you guys, so we will make a deck save real quick. I Do I see anything coming? Are you looking behind you? Probably. There you go. And it, it's it's just a deck save because there's a lot of, you know, archers and shit. Going blah, blah, blah. Sorry, I was dealing with my cats. Is this everyone? See, so yeah. Interesting, it didn't didn't add my bonus. I, I noticed that. Huh. It's a 21. Because I have a plus 9. Yeah. But, um... Not adding one. 24. It's not adding anyone's bonus for the save. Yeah, it would have been interesting. That. <laughs> All of 20 sudden. for 25. Uh... Jeezy's the only one that failed. Uh, however, I rolled five ones on the damage dice. For a total of five, re reduced to fucking two. Mm. <laughs> and then no. half of you just say, nah. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> so the mug is struck nah. for the two. Mm -hmm. the, the buttons getting healed for a total of uh, nine. Uh, yeah. Okay, by 11. <laughs> and technically speaking, oh. 
If they shoot at me, I can technically catch your, it. Your reaction it to slowfall? Huh? You hmm? lose your reaction for slowfall. Yeah, for deflect oh, missiles, you have to use a reaction. And I it didn't has know this to hit as you. I was falling. Yeah. But you took five damage. Oh wait, no, you're a monk. You took none. Hell yeah. <laughs> uh, Gulch takes none. I think, right? He doesn't Correct. take any that fucking matters because he heals next turn. Uh, yeah, you just take an inconsequential amount of damage and then you're gone. <laughs> just play none because I would have killed it. Uh, yeah, yeah. You're gone. Do what you want. You got people yeah. that can heal in the party. And then you heal, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, so we need to get out of here and get like back to our country, right? That's correct, war criminal. I'm not a war criminal. <laughs> that is very true, war criminal. Uh, ah! I was improvising. Telly ho, fall in line, war criminal. <laughs> uh, northwest, split off near Dairon. Those who can cross the border, cross the border. Those who can't, uh, go north. I don't think any of us are going to be able to cross the border. Let's do it. Hey, you know, it's probably right. Let's all of us go northwest. We'll have to hop the border again. Gulch, prepare the sombreros. Don't worry, I have been working on them this entire time. <laughs> Just been burning through the streets, weaving the sombreros. <laughs> Just a bunch of loose reeds just getting them together. As you run through the fields, you just rip up <laughs> some reeds, you see? It just... <laughs> Don't worry, guys. In a week's time, Heatport will be reduced to ash. It's not well, very comforting. Wherever the hell we are. I'd rather oh. not be your big... Clomaniac of a mother? I, I can't tell her what to do. She's at war with this place, so... Their duke is gone. One of their dukes, at least. There's a power vacuum. They'll be infighting, which will weaken their nation's strength. And then, boom! Goodbye. Indeed, so... We should probably go here as soon as possible, especially if uh, you don't want to meet his mother, Jaden. So, north, northwest. I'd rather not. Yeah, so let's. All the uh, stories wrong. I've heard aren't great. And they're all true. That's the scary part. She's fucking That's terrifying the in person. Because <laughs> he just reads his book. <laughs> <laughs> also, she's you, running in writing. You. I like Jaden. Jaden like points. Like walk towards um, Elman. You do blood magic. Yes, I will explain that once we're out of this country. Hey, Elman. Can we explain while we run? Uh, yes. No, that's not possible. No, but it's like you look over at Elman, and he's already like. <laughs> 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 Gods. <laughs> Fucking wizards. <laughs> it's like, dude, he's a wizard, my dude. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. <laughs> you need to spend some time in the gym. Right? Work on your party. <laughs> Maybe I will. Teach you how to rage. Alright, well, hmm, fuck. Let's just go. Yep. There's no extra. There, there's extradition treaties on the border. We won't be sent back. We're okay. They still just hop the border, regardless.
Gulch takes off running, Bun Bun's hanging out for dear life. Mm-hmm. The horns were right on your tail. It full blast. I'm not that fast. Keep it, keep it over here. <laughs> uh, okay, slight recalculation then. Saki, you don't flick to the forehead, you feel fast. You, you get the effects of Longstrider. <laughs> and then the alarm take off. Alright, cool. um, I move a hole 60 feet. So you guys can move about 80 feet. You're about halfway through the day. So if you guys want to risk some late night bullshit you can run through the night and <clears throat> risk exhaustion Yer. Yer. Um. <laughs> you, you glad about those e-boats aren't you will <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I stopped Where's over how far are we Measure it. Just before the point of the exhaustion, at least. <clears throat> well, if you don't push through the night, you guys can travel. We'll cut it into a third, and third two thirds, and say 20, 20 miles. I just realized my mic was muted. Oh. That might be. I was wondering why. If you so press quiet. control, and then yeah. We can make it to the trees. I mean, you can make it back into the forest somewhere there. Yeah. yeah, let's do that. <clears throat> All right. Like, up like, your <laughs> don't breathe through your mouth, just through he, your nose. He's running with like his arms straight up, <laughs> breathing backwards. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I the texture, it's, I texture, it's the texture, opposite. Texture. It's like the opposite of a Naruto run with like the arms. <laughs> Instead of them rotated <laughs> down all the way, they're rotated up all the way. <laughs> I would technically be moving faster if I had my uh, current movement speed, but I had to use that to go over the wall. Yep. Um, so you guys book it. Haul ass. Well into the night. How are you guys camping? Uh, she here. We're gonna, we're gonna have people do lookout stuffs. Hey. I, 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 I can pop up another tower? I could, but... He's in size tower, so... It's not a stealthy tower. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm pointing <clears throat> Since we're yeah, at we're this point, I'll... Out a bubble. I'll also... Yeah. I'll also point out... Nobody... Attempted to cover their tracks, hide out what they're doing, be stealthy the entire no. run. Correct. It's a war zone. We're not gonna do that. I'm. I'm. No, no. I'm just saying. We have to get out before we yep. hide stuff. So. There's just... bombs going off left and right. We gotta book it. <laughs> There's war <laughs> criminals there. We gotta run. <laughs> There's this crazy air genasi war criminal. It's just insane. <laughs> I already blew up a bunch of civilians. <laughs> uh, but Jaden, as for popping down Landman's tiny hut, cannot. I don't have the spell um, slots for it. If you guys want, I can just stay up, keep watch. Um, I, I don't really need this. I can 
kind of just sit down and rest. I don't really need to fall asleep. Sounds like magic bullshit. Cool, sounds good. Have fun. Lauren's gonna start scaling a tree. Himself in some branches. Settle pile and, with Gulp and, and Saki. Yep. Before Saki would like to like hide. Like once we hit the trees, start hiding tracks. Okay. Make a survival check. What? Can it be a stealth check? No, as you are covering up something versus having done it in the moment. What about a sleight of hand check? No. Mm -hmm. Because you gotta make it look natural. I'm not natural. the best to do this then. Because you, you, you're trying to make it look natural. Yeah. Is someone with better survival able to do this? My survival's a plus five. Does any... One, so. This is an open question to the table. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go around the table one by one. <laughs> Since you I all are quiet. Plus three. Jade, cool. what's your survival? I have a Plus three. Almond, what's your survival? Plus four. Gulch has the highest survival. <laughs> oh boy. I'll roll, I guess. Can I assist? Yes, you may. Are you proficient? No. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> Damn. Total of 20. <laughs> Would you like me to give you your last hey, listen of the session? Your last rights. The last. Hey, hey, listen. Hey, hey. listen. Yeah. Hey. Or would you like me to save it for a possible future moment? Oh, you're only giving us one. I have given you several this this session. Well, you do love us, so mm -hmm. that's why I've given you several. No. No. <laughs> no. Because there, there is something you guys are forgetting. <laughs> the steel defender just walking down. <laughs> <laughs> He's slowly, <laughs> slowly walking. Oh, um, what's his, what's his, hold on, I have his stat. Hold on. He has a movement speed of 30, just uh, walking. <laughs> just slowly walking down afterwards. Um, so would you oh, like me to God. give you a, a heads up about something? Fine. Jeezy, you have a certain spell that will enhance an ability. I do. What does that Hold spell do? It doesn't count have... because Cheesy was muted. She's been saying it this entire I've... time. <laughs> I've been muted and jumped on my desk. <laughs> I have a spell called Enhanceability <laughs> that gives you advantage on your checks. Let me grab it real quick. Oh, and you're, you're within range, right? On what? For that bonus? The aura protection or that does saves. saves. That's for saves. Okay. There, there uh, is one paladin that does do checks, but she is not said paladin. Yeah. Um, I'll give you Owl's Wisdom, which is advantage on wisdom checks, which will give you an advantage on your survival check. Good luck. So go ahead and pick that survival check at advantage, Gulch. Still a 20. Still a 20. Alright. You believe you have done a very good job at hiding traps in the forest. Well, no, you, 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 you backtracked a little bit and you, you did a decent amount and you feel you did a pretty good job hiding your tracks. So what I do is I'll spend like 10 minutes, 5 minutes going in an opposite direction cracking branches, stuff like that, and then mm -hmm. retrace my steps five minutes back. Mm -hmm. um, and you do the important, the, the smart thing of, yeah, I cover this, this area by taking everything around it and covering this area. 
Mm -hmm. You know, like, where they clear out these two side paths along their path. Mm -hmm. What do you yes. mean? I covered my path. Well, well, yeah, but you left two other ones. Uh, you do not do that. You take this off from the decoy path. <laughs> Alright. You guys feel secure, safe. Uh, you guys come bunker down for for rest. It's just gonna sit down and uh, look around, and he's gonna do that all night. Okay, go ahead make a perception check. You have dark vision, right? Uh, uh, where can I see that again? Senses. It is under senses where your passive wisdom and stuff is at. On the main yeah. page. Right below your saving throws. I'm assuming that. If, uh, if there's nothing there, no. then the answer is no. no. Alright, so... Anyone want to give me dark vision? <laughs> I don't know how that works. There, There there's is a, a spell there, dark vision. <laughs> it's like, there's dark I mean, vision I spell. don't have that. <laughs> it is a I also don't spell. have dark vision. So it's pretty, pretty often not taken. Um, Jaden, you have to trust me on this. If I pee on you, you'll have dark vision. Make a deception check. Make a deception check. <laughs> I trust that. I love that. Go. I, uh, make it's a deception check. <laughs> it's like, make a deception check. It's not great. <laughs> <laughs> it's a seven. With that, do with that seven as you will, Jaden. I, I I don't believe you. Roll for inside. I'm That's the smart choice. And then go over and I just go pee somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so as you guys have started to settle down, did you want to have any conversations now in the fading light of the night? Or... Yeah, I'm gonna sit Jaden down and have him talk about his war criminal activities. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't. I'm good. I'm good for that. Yeah. Does everyone hear that cat toy in the background? Nope. Not okay, good. Not. Hey, Leo. Mm hmm? Do we want to have that chat now, or we want to wait? Uh, we said we we're gonna wait till Marcus. That's right. We should That's definitely right. be quiet until you know, we're safe. That's true. Oh yeah, Tech Kelly. Me awake since I just had to sleep. Mm -hmm. I usually in my little trance state, so. Hellman. Yo. Blood magic. Explain. Now. Why right now? Are you gonna do that yes, when everyone's, while everyone's awake? asleep? Yeah, I was gonna say. Are you gonna do that before or after everyone goes to sleep? Sorry. Or you can have a cute personal talk. Huh? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna talk to everyone about it. I think. I'm gonna look longingly into his eyes. Mm. All you see is uh, starts playing. All you see is like dark blue eyes, relatively. Deep, deep sapphire eyes that like, just go on forever. Yeah. <laughs> Not a single thought behind those eyes. Nothing. <laughs> 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 so, you, you, you can do blood magic and you turn it into a shadowy mess. What's up with that? I can explain that. I would like to explain to everyone. Saka oh, rolls over. We're supposed to be hiding. Precisely. Fine. I'll sit here quietly. As the darkness comes over, as the last sheds of light go beyond the horizon, Jaden, make a perception check at disadvantage. You got it. 
And that's a 19. Mm -hmm. A 15. Not right. A 7. That's a 22. That's not bad. Ah, okay. Um. You. The night goes on and on. Uh, is everyone just sleeping straight through the night, minus Jaden? And me, Jaden. Well, you're trancing. Yeah. Yeah, trancing up in a tree. Trancing. <laughs> so you guys slam through the night, right? Unless woken up. All right. Oh, oh, I forgot it was muted. Um, I said I would take a shift if people need to rest. Uh, Jaden does I not need to rest. Is. I only need four hours. I would say the, the two elves need four hours. Jaden needs zero hours of sleep, but he still does need eight hours of minimal to no activity. And do any of those people who only need four hours have dark vision or enhanced yes. senses? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you guys think we're going to be safe? Safe is very relative. That's what I'm saying. Like, Gulch can take a few hours up at night and be on watch. I have advantage on perception. It's up to you guys. I I'll leave that up to you. I'm, I'm going to be up all night regardless. How many hours of sleep do you need, Gulch, for a long rest? Eight? A uh, regular person. Eight? Yeah, yeah. I got eight. If you take a shift, that will extend how long you need to stay here. All right. If you guys think we're gonna be oh, okay, I'll, I'll, take a I'll, take, I'll take a full rest. People who need eight take eight. People who take who need four take a shift. So, I will offer you guys this: you guys can take six, not gain the benefits of a long rest, but also not uh, gain exhaustion. You can gain the benefits of a short rest. It'll count as if you got a, a night's rest and not trigger the exhaustion from not sleeping. I think we should take the full fall rest. Yeah, okay. I'll, yeah. I'll be up for four hours by myself, but then the elves will get up at the four hour mark and then there'll be three people watching. Mm -hmm. Is, is where not you're going to give them an extra two hours to find us? Find us. Your guys is everyone roll me a stealth check okay uh cheesy because you're not moving around you don't get disadvantage from your armor oh thank god 22 i got a 21 21 as well 22 21 jesus ram 21 Ripplets. crew hey. Twelve at the highest. Mm. Um, I want to reward all those twenty ones, so I'll take a somebody roll me a a d eight for me, and I'm gonna take that off of my tallied roll. Um, can I roll? Sure. 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 Seven. Seven. Nice. Good. You needed at least a six. Nice. Um, because they rolled a twenty-six. Total. Well, so I rolled a one d six for every hour, and I just kind of added them up, and that was their DC, and they rolled better than I thought they would. Um, so they got a twenty-six minus your d eight, and that lowers them below a twenty-one. Which I'm treating as the average. We're close enough to it, so. Nice. You guys managed to 
barely avoid capture. Uh, <clears throat> Saki, did you attune to the amulet? I would have if you would allow me. Also, you can, you can 21 was the average. Yeah, I was like, yeah, like it, a, it was 20.5. It, it was the average. Yeah. <laughs> um, I was like, it's, it should be. I, I knew it was a little bit off 21, but it was like close enough. It's to close enough for rounded up. Yeah. <clears throat> um, towards the end, you guys are getting up, and you're kind of have this panicky. You heard some rustling you know, a bit off gulch, a bit off in the distance. You're like, shh, 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 shh. And that faded off. And then you hear this loud. Guys, <laughs> and you, you, you guys start panicking and then busting through the bushes is <laughs> the steel defender. For some reason, an 8 bit version of Every Morning by Sugar Ray is playing from the back. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna read the last paragraph of the amulet. Uh, when you attune to the amulet, the you know the distance and direction of the shield going. And there's more of it, but you know. Yeah. I know it's coming. I, I know that it is approaching. Did, oh. did Saki From tell the them? Saki right. is a fan of Sugar Ray, okay. <laughs> so, Saki, <laughs> did you tell them that it was coming as you saw everyone panic as they heard Kathunk Kathunk Kathunk? I would have, yes. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Who's like, low. Uh, what die are you rolling? D-100. D hundred high. Or high. Low. Okay, if it's above fifty, I told you that would be a six. <laughs> I was <laughs> like, I was like, you said that awfully quick for Saki. It was like, Are you certain Saki wouldn't take the opportunity. Okay, so it was a six and double zero. <laughs> That's sixty. Okay, because beyond so, counted as a six. But I thought the double zeros were ten. Double zeros are ten unless. The single digits also a zero. Okay. So yeah, it was a six and double zero. Whatever you want to count that as. <laughs> oh well, if they said six, I get six. Okay. Nah. <laughs> oh wait, yeah, no, double zero is a zero unless the zero unless is, is also a zero. Yeah. And in which case, then it's out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, Saki forgot that. Like, she, the, there's a sense coming from the sound, so it's the sound <laughs> aims the gun. <laughs> well, I mean, you, you knew it was the M. You knew it was uh, the defense. She just woke up. But Saki's also like, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Saki's like super absent minded, but in like the cutest way. Yeah. Huh. Deception check. I gotta hide the excitement. Everyone's 16. 16. As you, you, everyone make an insight check. Oh, oh boy. Ooh, not great. Yikes. <laughs> 12. Nine. 14. Wow. I Good. win. <laughs> oh my god. I don't beat Jake, but I win. <laughs> I beat Jake, but I win. Uh, yeah, everyone else said. Can said, I infer that that's what's going on? Uh, you know, I just like to see the inside of her. You hear heavy footsteps approach, and then you look over at Saki, and she's doing the, the little hee 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 face. <laughs> Shit, heal the thunder. Aww. You ruined the fun. Being a dead. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I was. I've been up all night, bored. That's your fault. I played, I played Boulder Parchment Shears with myself all night. Again, your fault. And I lost like fifty percent of the time. <laughs> that is one hundred percent your fault. <laughs> well, you guys get up early. You guys all get your long rest and. Short rest. No, you no, took no, the you took the long rest. Long rest. Yeah. Poop. Zoom head off. We go. 
Up the Marrakesh we go. Stealthily or not stealthily? Stealth is half speed. How do you think clear? With the uh, Defender, are we even going to be able to do stealthily? Hold on. Hold on. Is she de the Defender? It, it's not magically summoned. It's, it's just... It's, it's a thing. There. It's not a spirit. It's not a familiar. It's just a thing. It's there. Also, get rid of it, then. I, I don't think we should get rid of it. As soon as we cross the border, we're safe. Have it walk as we to do 60 feet away from us. Because that's still within command range. So, I guess the real question is full speed or half speed? Full speed! Alright. So not. Full speed is not stealthy. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Azura is not stealthy. She would not choose cat speed. <laughs> <laughs> she just goes. Alright. You guys can travel 30 miles in a day. Sands a little bit. Pop back down on the road down here. Almost. Oh. All right. Um, who wants to pick high or low, and who wants to roll a D hundred? I can roll a D hundred this time. Hell yeah. E. All right. Yeah. Who wants to pick higher low? Uh, low. So you want to pick higher low? Seventy-seven. So you pick now. <clears throat> so if I am lower than hers. Which I am because I rolled a 76. Oh my god! Good grief. <laughs> um, you guys managed to find one of the handful of spots along this wall that is not complete. Nice! Oh, thank god. Boop. Uh, you get about there, Chris Desert. Okay. Because remember, it's half movement, half travel through here. Yeah. But you are back into the in between lands. Not technically safe, but also safer. Sure. Because the, the whole Shattered Stand Hills area. Uh, Neither no man's land. neither empire or kingdom has quote unquote legal jurisdiction, but that also means there's technically no laws here. There's a law of power, and that's about it. So as you guys are in the forest, er, forest in the desert night comes and it gets cold Lemon's tiny heart would you like hut or tower I just that, would be, that would be easier to conceal unless we can see outside of it We're back in safe lands. Yeah. Alright. 
guys get the hut. Luckily, you don't have to deal with freezing cold temperatures. Because deserts are fucking cold at night. Uh -huh. Somebody that hasn't rolled one of my checks roll a D hundred for me. And somebody else that didn't pick high or low. Pick high or low. <laughs> Hi. Alright. Hi, how are you? Hi, how are you? Alright, I have my roll. Ninety-five. Ooh. Oh. Right. <laughs> you you can pick high or low now. No, you really did excited, oh. but... Low. Low? Okay, yeah, I rolled a two. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you have a peaceful night. Or a peaceful... Yeah, you have a peaceful night. You guys can pick up and travel again. Ooh. I should really draw the board. board. And... And, um... I have a helmet wake up at around like the four hour mark and you just see Jade play older parts that she hears with himself in the corner. <laughs> just sitting there recording. <laughs> Quiet. Sitting there writing in my book. Jaden being very bored, not knowing what to do for eight hours straight. No. Oh jeez. Oh, oh jeez. So, 10, 20, so another 10 miles. Uh, unless, knowing that we're going over the Shattered Sandhills. Just so you check the length for this. Uh, what would be our movement speed in an hour, roughly, Shiny? You can travel 30, hour, 30 miles a day. <laughs> Alright, if we're spending roughly 16 hours, eh, I'll say 14 hours traveling in a day, right? You can travel 30 miles a day. You, you can house, parse out however you want, you can travel 30, 30 miles a day. Because that's what the rule book says. Okay, so it's only 10 miles to that there. Uh, I'll use freedom of movement. So for two hours of that to get us onto the road. Which uh, should allow us to be able to not be affected by difficult terrain. I'm not affected by difficult yeah, well, not all of us are you, my guy. About here, you guys might be able to catch a cart or carriage going back and forth, merchant caravan. Perfect. That you could hide along with. It'd still be. You know what? No. Let's, let's roll. Let's roll one more D100 face off. Who wants to roll me a D100? Right. Wizard boy. You want me to run over roll a D100? Yeah, go for it, man. Goat. What? Higher low of his D hundred. Once you roll, I'm gonna wait for him to send me a message. 
No, I'm joking. Um, <laughs> hi. I mean, you can wait till after he rolls. Yeah, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna stick to my guns and just say hi. What's your so what's the D hundred roll? I can't I can't roll D hundred. Well, guess you should roll it again then. Maybe on Foundry. Okay. D and D Beyond has a D one hundred. Yeah, but he said it was. I'll show you. Yeah. Oh. Yes. <gasps> Hi, baby. So which one am I rolling? Up? Is he roll? Am I rolling higher or lower than him, Gulch? Oh. Uh, I'm gonna say low. Jesus, fuck! I rolled a hundred. No, you didn't. This is it's a one. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's three zeros. <laughs> exactly, it's a zero. <laughs> 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 Uh, you managed to find a, a a trade caravan. However, they are camping for the night, but it is safety, kind of. You're not going to be sharing their camp, but you can be kind of near their camp. Oh, I can't befriend them, the cute little bunny. Of travelers that just showed up. I mean, you can attempt to. <laughs> we can have spars! <laughs> <gasps> yes, let's make some mores with them. Yeah. I like to assist. Woo woo. Yee. <laughs> How are you <laughs> is assisting? That like a, is that a persuasion to befriend them? I don't know. Be because, um, Rachel Freak, um, I'm a fixin'. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What if they don't mm -hmm. like foxes? I'm then they're bad people. <laughs> <laughs> Making you not only a smooth talker, but a good deflector. What if I they're proficient? What if they're gay? I am proficient. <laughs> I am proficient. Then Gulch has got it for <laughs> <Persuasion> <laughs> Gulch it. has it. Oh, so Gulch is going to flirt with them? Hey, if you don't like foxes and you're not at least 15% a furry, I don't trust you. <laughs> 15%. I was gonna say 13.6. I was I was gonna say you're like a 13 point something. <laughs> you know, just make it an odd number for no fucking reason. Am I persuading I'm anybody? Waiting. Uh I'm sorry. I wanna be a friend! What was your role? Do am I rolling persuasion? An advantage? I would assume you're trying to persuade them to do that. To hang out with them. Yeah, I would pursue. I would assume that would be persuasion to persuade oh, them. What? Plus Intimidation. Six. Hang out with I us. would like to make the roll with advantage from Jeezy's help. Hell yes. Okay. Woo! Oh boy. Roll. That's a dirty twenty. Woo! <laughs> You know, if M I was here, I'd be trying to like, yeah, they're all over it. But it's not as much fun. Hee 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 don't need What's no up, man. Ren? Uh, yeah, what's the party doing right now? The party is running back to um, Markash. Well, no, we're making indirectly. Sports. Correct. They are. 
they found a trade caravan as they were fleeing from the neighboring kingdom. Uh, and they've convinced this trade caravan to make s'mores with them. We're friends. Um, they kind of over, you know, you guys being cute and adorable and persuading them. Uh, they, they kind of let some of their guard down, but they're still pretty, you know. That's okay. Strange people don't come to my cart. That's you, okay. You, you can sit over there near the, the fire, but stay okay. away from my cart. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's, there's still this slight, I don't really know you. Because there's just like, <laughs> so where are you going? <laughs> what you doing? To a hedge bro. <laughs> to sell what you stuff. What are you doing there? Oh, to sell things? What do you sell? Stuff. I, I, stuff. You, you like found like the one like intern that's like 16 years old. Doesn't really know what he's doing. And he's just like... She's just shoving marshmallows <laughs> in her mouth and you are Um I don't know. Um stuffing things. Wow. Stuffing things. Where are you traveling from? We're traveling I don't think we're sitting. I'm coming from well, Gyron. Okay. Ooh, that's a long way. Um, I mean, I guess. <laughs> it's like, he doesn't know what to do with you. It's Azura. What's your name? Dylan. Hi, Dylan. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> Swallows the, <laughs> the marshmallow, like, mostly all. He didn't know what to do with it. <laughs> you need one. another one? And then they're Saki. Hi. Hi. <laughs> um, hi. You have pretty eyes. Mm, thanks. Um. Your hair's like, I guess. Um. Hey! Oh. He's, he's like, hands are like in his lap, held together, his legs are close together. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. These two ladies are talking to me. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm just a little bunny rabbit. And Saki is all over it. <laughs> Saki knows what she's doing. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh huh. Sure. I am making friends. Mm -hmm. And the camera pans over to add my. Me, 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 how tall is Dylan? Oh. <laughs> oh. He's a tall, lanky boy. He's six foot six and a hundred and and a hundred and forty pounds. Oh my! <laughs> He's a I'm lanky. Boy. He's a lanky beanstalk. <laughs> He's, he's still got, like, acne and stuff, and he, he looks, like, really self-conscious about it. Oh, and these so really cool adventure party ladies are talking to him. <laughs> you don't happen to have any cool stuff like ours, and then I just pull out, like, my my giant, like, Devotee's cleanser <laughs> that, the fist that just comes out like, uh, incense. I light incense and it smells nice. Do you have a favorite scent? Because I, I can make that. Make the um, whole camp smell like that. I I kind of like lilac. <laughs> I, mean... I also like lilac. Let's burn some incense. <laughs> okay. And, and the rest of you guys are watching this along with the merchants and the merchants are just eating it up. They are enjoying the shit out of this. <laughs> oh, I was gonna write my notes. Met a uh, intern named Dylan. Alma <laughs> is also writing a list. <laughs> He's like looking over. 
And then anyone looking over the book is like, is this, like, score a six, now doing seduction. Like, like an hour, or how long are you guys doing this? Uh, probably an hour if he allows. I w he doesn't know how to, he, you think he knows how to set boundaries? Oh my god. <laughs> um... <laughs> <laughs> After like an hour of it, he can see like the the merchants are kind of like noticing that it's kind of winding down, and one of them that is drunk, just absolutely plastered by this point, goes, "Hey, doing single, by the way." <laughs> uh, <laughs> he goes, okay. Shut up. <laughs> well, my devotion's to Torm, and I just. <laughs> <laughs> like, <woo -hoo! laughs> There's this Saki, make no, a perception no. check. Hold on. Okay. Before I do that, I imagine that Saki is like Dylan sitting, right? Yes. Azura is next to him. Mm -hmm. And I imagine Saki is like standing in front of both of them with like her hands on them. He's just watching both of them. Her, her little tail is like switching back. Mm -hmm. He's, so he's trying not to look at you, Saki. I'm aware. Mm. He's also trying not we to look at his server. He's looking straight and down. <laughs> well, um, that's not very polite not to make eye contact with people are talking to you, so. I mean, he looks at so you perception. when he's talking to you, but he's like, he's he's extremely embarrassed in this situation. <laughs> and nervous. Perception check. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Perception. Oh, that's a, that's a 25. Um, it's not like, it's not like he was wanting you guys to be excited, but the immediate, no, I'm, I pay attention to Tor, was like, a blow. <laughs> I kind of have, um, an amulet strapped to my chest. Oh, well, yeah. But, I mean, it's a little... <laughs> it, it was the immediate... I don't care if he's single, I'm devoted to Tor. He goes, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Still, like, the hands on these, one hand goes, pat, pat, pat. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find a girlfriend. <laughs> you just gotta get out there and shoot your shot. <laughs> I'm a pretty good wingman, I've been told. <laughs> Come on, you can practice with me. <laughs> and, and I think at that point, I might gets up and she grabs you goes, MINE! He walks off. <laughs> what? Okay. He down here, down, man! Yeah. <laughs> She's strong, yeah. independent <laughs> woman! <laughs> hey, Shiny. Unfortunately, I have to get going here. I just received a text from my place of employment. Mm. All of our front desk people called out, so I gotta be in network at 6 o'clock. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Oh, Someone please blow up God. my car. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, much love to you guys all. Enjoy yep. the rest of the session. I'll catch y'all later. Bye. 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 Yeah. Um, so, through your uh, embarrassment of Dylan, he, you know, the night goes on and you end up <clears throat> getting some warm rest and can proceed to get your way into Hedgerow. In the following day. Kapow. 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 Still getting dragged away as soon as we get there. Bye, Dylan. <laughs> you like <laughs> hid in the cart. <laughs> Wait, we didn't get his, like, his, like, contact information or anything? What if, like, we want to send cool pictures back and forth? Like, when <laughs> I, phone. when we, like, that oh. one, one headless picture that we had. Oh my god. <laughs> slide of hand, can, can I have sleight of hand checked at some point to grab his phone and get his contact? I'm just assuming he has a phone. I still How suck dare. you, we As... bad my... <laughs> <laughs> I will roll stealth and sleight of hand if you let me. <laughs> you gonna pilfer for Dylan's pockets? Yeah, I gotta find his phone. He's not gonna ask me on his own. Okay, go ahead and search for. A phone. He sounds so defeated. <laughs> okay. 
Find I a phone. Damn. It's phone plans. Maybe the are training expensive. guys will give me their autograph. Fucking. Do you want my autograph? Oh, yes. <laughs> you just trade autographs. <laughs> yes. It's like trading so cards. <laughs> How basic. Keep in mind, uh, he's as excited as you are yes! about it. So. He's on your same light blink. I want I wanna know this the trading people, like the, the bosses or whatever, if they have like a business card or anything. I just had girl time. <laughs> um <laughs> They've they, they do not have for uh, supplies. They don't have any cards or anything. They they say they're just small time merchants. Okay, then autograph time. Let's make a persuasion check. Alrighty. With advantage? It's like they don't even have like a group name. It's a or 21. Anything. 21. Mm. Why do you want a autograph? Are you one of those weird people that they can do stuff with names? Well, no, that's that no. one. <laughs> that's that one. <laughs> so. So no, you want to give me well, my I name? I find you sometime, and you make it big. I'll have your name, and I'll be like, well, I knew we'll, them, or they were even cool. We'll have your you name, know? and we can we can find it that way. I mean, fine, that works too. <laughs> Just exchange information. Yeah, they, I mean, you write down names and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Douglas in is the... years, this will come back to us. <laughs> Douglas is the the name of the head merchant in the group, and he's he's Dylan's uncle. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm writing this down. Card. And he's doing this as a favor to his to his brother, Jeffrey. <laughs> Jeffrey, Douglas, and Jeffrey. <laughs> And then that goes to a for your favor and then that person named Bob. <laughs> yeah, is there like great grandpa? Head. Head of small trading company. They have Man, like I wish I was a hat. <laughs> <laughs> they have like Jesus. They have like two carts, one for the people and one for the the actual goods. And they're not even like big carts. It's like like a like a, a wagon cart. It's a wagon. They have a wagon cart and then like a cart cart. I love that for them. It's like four people, and the other two are just some fucking uh, Richard body, and bod uh, bodyguards they hired that don't want to give you their name. <laughs> Well, but his they don't name have anything Richard, fun to, like, purchase or trade. Do you want to buy pelts? That makes me sad. Do I want to buy pelts? I'll purchase one pelt for the cause. I think it's like, <laughs> I think it's like two silver or something. Well, I'll give them a tip so they get one gold. <laughs> and then I get a really cool pelt and I'm going to wear it as a cape. Um... This is when I get really maniacal and say it's a fox pelt. I was gonna ask. Oh my <laughs> lordy! <laughs> well, it's very soft. Look at me. Look at me. Inventory. It smells of lilac items. now because of you. Yes. <laughs> Custom item. <laughs> I've done this so many times. <laughs> Fox pelt. <laughs> Notes. Smells like lilac. Heart emoji. Quantity one. 
the cost is two silver. Um, let's see. What kind of inn do you guys want to go in? Go, or tavern do you guys want to find? Or common good? Oh, I just like to collect things. <laughs> I just like to collect all the things. Yeah. You know, I don't think I need anything. So, well, because you get here kind of late at night. Uh, uh huh. Okay, so we're not just gonna gotcha. teleport and be late tomorrow. Oh, you guys can. No, I like the adventure. Let's keep going. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Gotta meet more Douglases and Jeffries. <laughs> just find an inn to stay in. Alright. Uh, yeah. would you guys want to look for, like, a poor one? Like, a really low-class one? Uh, a, uh, uh, like a decent common mid or good? Solid mid. mid. I'm using mid. a generator. Those mid. are your three options. So, common. Common. Yes. Uh, Shiny, I believe we said mid. <laughs> well, I gave you three options. <laughs> so, um... Do you like to look for one in an area that's kind of like more adventurous or located or deeper into town? More adventures. Yeah. Okay, I have If we hang with adventures, we'll probably get more info. It's Just called... like the going. <laughs> it's called the Cracked Flask. Ooh, okay. Uh, oh, I actually really like that. In a temple quarter surrounded by shadowed alleys and grand shrines, the street outside is lined with street vendors hawking relics. Well, not anymore because it's night. Um, <laughs> the inn is a two story stone walled building with dwarf wrought iron tables and chairs. A small dragon skull hangs over the hearth located inside. Accommodations consist of several large rooms with beds and straw mattresses. Behind Wait. the innkeeper, you see, is a short female dwarf. What's her name? Are you going to walk up and say hi? I am going to walk up and say hi. That's what it's <laughs> well, about. Howdy there. How are y'all doing in here? You coming in a long time? Hi. You staying for a night? Yeah. You know how long you want. Just one night. Well, um, I'll ride it then. I see. How many rooms? How many you want? I'm looking over at Gulch like he's my safety blanket. Uh, I'll hold up two fingers. Two ropes. <laughs> Alright then. You guys want some food with that as well? We only got a couple options, kinda late, so we already just turned off the turned off the uh, the oven a little bit ago. Oh I'm Shake just my, head head my apologies, my name. <clears throat> My name is Thaga. T H A G A. Thaga. The fact that she uh, starts her, she says her name and then spells it. Well, yeah, a lot of people like to think that it's Dagger with a D, but no, it's with a T. Oh, no. I do got a dagger ass. though, and she reaches, butter. she reaches underneath the table and like pulls out a dagger, and it's like the cheapest fucking dagger you could find, oh. Oh. <laughs> like some mold press dagger. I'd like some, some food, if possible. Well, we've we've still got some some vegetable stew. Uh, we can get you some stewed bear and blue, or some some blue bleh, some stewed bear and blue cheese on top. Um, we got a little bit of that left. Carrots. Uh, yeah, we got some carrots. And, you know, we we usually throw them in with the vegetables too, but we can just take them out and put them on the side if you want. Perfect. We also got some. Some ale. If you guys want some of that, you guys got some water. I swear to God, I thought you said I, we also got some elf. <laughs> Ooh, what you doing? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? <laughs> Looks at the half elves. Oh my God! A rare delicacy. Y'all, I screw. <laughs> I scrolled <laughs> down on this inn. <laughs> it shows patrons. Oh, no. I'm just gonna read the first parts and their alignments. <laughs> Because I'm not going to use this. Diwali, male dwarf cleric, evil. <laughs> Nerwani, female elf ranger, evil. 
Margaret, female evil. human assassin, evil. Fyra, oh Margaret, my god. female elf assassin, evil. Funda, oh female dwarf paladin, what? neutral. Al Ooh. Alamran, oh. male elf fighter, evil. I go to the front door and I lock it. <laughs> I'm just like, There's what, no the voice. <laughs> what the Tanner's fuck is this generation? <laughs> so many assassins. I was waiting for you to say, human assassin, oddly enough. Good. It's <laughs> like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> <laughs> it was like evil, evil, evil. I guess it's a de stressing time, guys. <laughs> hey, as long as you don't break nothing, you'll be fine. You guys have any like, bread and jam? Well, we got some bread. Well, we know you know what we. It's it's a little bit of dry bread because it's normally had to go inside like the stews and stuff. But I mean, I, I just want I I'll just have some bread. I don't really need food. It, it's just like the, nice to do something. All right. Make sure you get enough you know nutrition inside your body. That, that I mean that's good. Why it's playing playing rock paper scissors by himself? Bless. <laughs> Well, <laughs> <laughs> okay. well, honey, I mean, as long as you keep keep fine and you know don't don't cause any trouble to the civilians and stuff, it'll be that's perfectly fine. Yeah, don't cause any troubles to civilians. <laughs> <laughs> <Squizzle> <laughs> <regin>. <laughs> but I tell you what, if, if once they start doing stuff, they're no longer civilians. That is true. Mm hmm. Got a couple gold for all of you guys, and everyone can get beds and food and drinks. Uh, so as you guys wrap up for for bed, and you're in no utilian kingdom, any conversation you want to have, or are you guys good for the session? I think we were gonna yell at Leo more, but well, he's not here, so. So we could just oh, go in on him. <laughs> you could also. Oh, you guys were gonna yell at me. Oh, we will. Well, don't, don't worry. worry about it. Now's your time. You're on the docket. Uh, We've also got the uh, talk about the blood magic. Yes. Ah, yes, yes. You do have that. Yeah, but talk again, I feel like everyone should be here for that. Am I everyone here for that? Yeah, everyone should be here for that conversation. <laughs> <laughs> You're running from, you know, the border. Oh, yeah, but you're in the kingdom now. Yeah, like now would be a good time to ask. If you guys want to wait until everyone's here. Oh, oh, oh. Can wait until we're in the safety of the guild hall. Yeah. You guys. Yeah, but. This is yeah, when I go. There's... You guys can have a conversation now, and when Leohorn asks what happened in a conversation, you can go. There's a VOD. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Since he loves to call out the VOD. Oh, uh, God. There's no extradition treaty here, but uh, Batman can always show up. Yep. So we gotta stand Besides, <laughs> Besides the other conversation we're gonna have, you guys could talk to me about war crimes. Yeah. Um, don't blow up carts with civilians in it. We weren't sure if there were civilians in it. And we are trying you're to not away. sure. If you're there not was... sure there's civilians in it, do there not blow it up. At the front of the cart. And you sent him That's flying. <laughs> I'm not fine. sure if you guys. If, 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 are you arm sure? Arm. Did you go back and look? No, but the god above no, all gods horses. said he did. How much? There, there was another cart that appeared. The, the guy came out and was like, brother! <laughs> uh, 
Are you guys aware just how much health a civilian has? Four. Ten. Ten. Do you remember how much damage you dealt, Jaden? A lot. Ten. And it's seventeen. <laughs> yeah. You killed a man. Well, you had What was among... my score? Seven. <laughs> what did I need to pass? Seven. Hundred. <laughs> Seven. Hundred. <laughs> <laughs> So what's it? It's okay to break the law when it's convenient for you, but not when your friends almost dead. Don't like breaking dead. the law. But Gold you just snaps. You did though. Well, like you didn't I'm want to sorry. kill a duke, a rich man, but a oh, civilian's fine. I don't want to kill anybody. Are you a class that, trader? I was panicking. <laughs> And during the that fight, and I didn't know what to do because they are kind of in the kingdom where the laws are made, and I like to follow the law. And fighting him would break the law, but he's also trying to hurt you guys. But blowing oh, up civilians not against, against the law. We already <laughs> killed him. We already broke the law. It doesn't even matter. Nothing matters anymore. <laughs> it's not about the law, Jake. It's, it's about your morals. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I heard morals I you heard the other thing. to have my back in a life and death situation. How can I trust you day to day? This is true. I'm oh, fine my. most of the time because most of the time we're killing monsters, but people, most of the time different. gets people killed. Also, most of the time when you kill monsters, what about those monsters here? <laughs> Those, there are... those monsters have families, you know. I just I don't like fighting people. Well, you did. Some people are bad people. Especially when they blow up your guild hall. But not when they're just obstructing your, <laughs> your Wait. path from running away. Wait. Wait. Also, Wait. You guys were past the carriage. Yeah. We were past the carriage! There was no reason. I don't know. In stressful situations, I panic or freeze up. Don't worry. I'm gonna set you on a course. We're gonna fight for five hours every day. And we'll get you you will get you we'll get you up to snuff so you don't panic in the heat of things. So, you just so see Azura put like war paint under her eyes. Yeah. It feels so <laughs> exhausting just listening to that. You're gonna crawl under barbed wire while I shoot a gun over your head and you gotta stay down and not panic. <laughs> this is live ammunition. Do not poke your head up. <laughs> it's probably blanked. <laughs> no, there's a movie with that. I can't remember the name of it. What? So there's this, there's this movie and they, they, you know, one of those, well, he's a veteran, let's bring him back and train these young bugs. So, and he's, like, breaking, like, all the rules and shit, training them. Uh, has him crawling underneath the barbed wire with live fire over top of him, and he's like, do not stick your head up, this is live fire, if you do, you will die. And someone was like, it's probably blank, and he sticks his head up and gets shot. <laughs> Yeah, the dude fucking panics, stands up, gets shot in the head, and the sergeant, the drill sergeant, runs over to his dead body. He's like, "You stupid motherfucker! I told you not to stand up. Look what you made me do! Look <laughs> what you made me do! Don't you <laughs> fucking idiot!" I remember watching it. Like, I can't remember the name of the movie. I can't it's remember. So fucking good. I was like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, this is some crazy crap. In boot camp. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it, it's I get stressed out when we're fighting people, and I freeze up, or, or I'll panic. Don't worry, Those boot are... camp will shake that out of you. He will literally shake it out of you. No, I, and I'm not joking. We're fighting for five hours once shit settles down. Rather not. I mean, you put our lives in jeopardy. It's no longer up to you. I'd rather I'd rather not fight you. And I'd I mean, rather not risk my life with someone who might just do nothing. That's true. 
I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't fix problems. Jin does. I, I don't want to fight him fix problems. And I don't want to die. I don't want to die either. I, I'm not. not trying to be a hard ass here, but you put everyone's life in jeopardy. I went down. Multiple times. times. Thank you, brain cell. <laughs> <laughs> High fives in the middle of this serious conversation. Just. <laughs> and I'm, I'm serious. Like, we're gonna have to run you through drills if you wanna be a part of this guild. So we go on missions where, like, four some odd people died or left. Like, we're in the shit. And you gotta get used to it. You gotta not panic under pressure. And the only way to do that is with drills. I care yeah, about you. I consider like... you a friend. I'm not trying to be mean. I just don't want to die due to someone's inactions. Why does it have to resort to violence? Um because we live in an actual hellscape <laughs> with <wrong>. monsters, <laughs> necromancers, vampire warlords. A vampire Dead. warlord literally came to the city with the guild and it kidnapped or took hostage of uh, a former guild member's girlfriend. Brutally Oh, yes. It wasn't murder. It wasn't murder because she wasn't dead. Yet. She's very close to dead. I don't need the yet bet part, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Good, sir. Keep your mouth shut. <laughs> I am sorry. I will try to not let it happen again. No, it won't. Zura has amazing spirit. Try is an excuse. You know, on my server, the um, the emote of the goblin with the weapons in its hand going, Wah! that's his <laughs> Yes. 100%. Hey, <laughs> Zura. <laughs> Duly noted, start up the Zura fan club. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't, don't. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be him. You look over, over and he's Head just over he's just torm. <laughs> he's just furiously typing away on his phone on all the social medias <laughs> posting all these pictures of you in combat looking like a fucking badass. Grab his phone, break it, stop it. They have geolocation. You're gonna give us away. <laughs> <laughs> Them 5Gs give cancer. <laughs> Them 5Gs give cancer. <laughs> <laughs> Pulls out the He's technically oh writing most of this down in his book. Yeah. Okay. Well, as I was taught, sir, with all your heart, as we all... What, what, what is this? What is it saying? Every failure of duty diminish, diminishes the loyal fury. Every success empowers him and frightens the world. There, we there you go. go. As Cheesy has a little bit of nosebleed. Or as <laughs> Zura has a little bit of nosebleed. <laughs> <laughs> I hate, I hate the nickname, but you joined the Cursed Guild. People die. It's a fact of life. And every time we step out in the field, there's a good chance you're not coming back. And you need to be prepared for that. Azura and Gold Fan Club. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Has two separate accounts for two different things. <laughs> yep. One is specifically for Azura, and the other one's Azura and Gulch. <laughs> Later, it's gonna be like Azura and Saki, and uh, <laughs> it just keeps branching out. 
the only post for the Azura and Gulch fan uh, one is just Gulch and Azura doing the Tokyo Calling, like, dance move. <laughs> Besides you guys being mad at me for doing things, uh, what, so, I, I've, like, the past couple nights in a row, just been sitting around all night, like, what am I supposed to do for eight hours? Never you could play. punch a tree. You could turtle. I can't do stuff. I still need to sit around for eight hours, but I, I really like, can't sleep anymore. Hence, you could journal. Journaling is a good way of getting your thoughts out in a very oh, healthy really? manner. Okay. You need a set of dark cards. <laughs> You can learn how to uh, play solitaire. Or play chess with yourself. You can learn how to juggle. Yeah, you good. I don't know what I'm gonna do. You can pray to Torm! <laughs> Pick up for this to year. me. <laughs> I, I, I already have a, I, I already have a religion. Tur oh, turn Gulch then. into the God King Emperor. Yes. <laughs> so not really. I, I don't really pray to him. God. Well, Maybe. you have eight hours to get. Maybe you oh, should. Do you want a book? You go look for a book for you. Books are good. Books are good. Pen, right? And then you're also learned. I don't know. Well, we gave you a lot of options, and you rejected all of them, so... I don't know what to do, okay? Leave me alone. Well, I guess people I'm are just gonna go sit. I'm just gonna go sit in this corner. You do that to yourself, you know. I'm gonna go bed. Yeah. Saki, Bun Bun, and I are going to our room. Kind of a lot to think about. <laughs> the fluffy Whoa. people. <laughs> I'm assuming Admi's gonna be included. Is Admi gonna be no. included in that because he's fluffy? Is no, no, no. We're doing a really cute besties time where we do our nails and we braid our hair. <laughs> And we talk about our crushes. So yeah. Our fiancés turned into dragons. See. <laughs> so the who's Adam your crush? Not part of that. <laughs> who's your crush then? Fun My... That's for us to gossip about, and you to find out. Torm. <laughs> 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 Torm. <laughs> 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 <Torm. laughs> he's buff. He's cute, and he's a good father figure. What more could you ask for? Buff, well, yeah! <laughs> yeah, Dauntless, though. So you guys... You're not wrong, girlfriend. <laughs> you guys get a, a long rest and can travel back. Sweet. Hell yeah. Um... I forget how much it is for teleports for everyone, but you can create that after session. This is some moment to get to. I, I can create oh, oh, yeah, you can do, you can do that. Yeah. You can just say we gave the money to figure out uh, how yeah. much after train no, back at the guild hall. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Excuse me, that was so interesting. That was so cool. Oh my god. You okay? I, 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 there was like a burp that wanted to come up, and then it didn't want to, and it went back down, and just kept going back and forth. Yo, I hate that. I was like, oh my god, figure out what you're doing, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> um, because I'm evil, I'm gonna do this. As you guys approach, sitting inside of your courtyard, there's a certain red-haired person that some of you recognize. 
Why is this? Wait. Huh? Is this a morally gray, beautiful vampire person? No, not not vampire. A different redhead. Okay. <gasps> is it my wife? No. Damn it. Is it his fiance? <laughs> The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting. Is it his fiance? Is it Leo, Leo Horns? Girl? No. No, no she is no. black hair. He has black hair. Black. Okay. Specifically, uh. Would you like to take a guess? That's mom has white, white. hair, right? White. White, yeah. Izzy and has it, white hair as well. And it's a female presenting individual? It is very feminine. Yes, they are. Okay. They didn't know this person? No. Do okay, I know this person? I, I, I don't know. No. Boy, does Zura know this person? Boy, who the fuck are I you? Think <laughs> Azura... Is it Rosie? It is not Rosie. Um, I think Azura does know them. Gulch knows them. Leo Horn knows them. Certain fiery person. No. 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 Oh my god. No. Oh, it's shit. on site. It's on site. Sitting. Oh shit. Reading a book, and on that oh. point, we're gonna end for this. Week. Oh. Nah, I'm gonna shove that book up right <laughs> now. Fuck it. you, man. Fuck you. We still. You took my best right? friend. You die on site. <laughs> Still hey. rank three, right? I've been wanting to have this interaction yes. so bad. I, I take out my, my earrings head. out. I take my rings <laughs> off. It is Here, no bitch, time. Hold no, my purse. Hold off. my wig. <laughs> <laughs> it is on <laughs> sight. Fuck you, Shane. Rings stay on. That's more damage. You would just gonna my delicate little hands. <laughs> but we're gonna grade the Grouch Couch. <laughs> what level spell is teleport? Uh. Fifth. Fifth. It's teleportation. I got Second. my thoughts and prayers on my knuckles. Let's fucking go. Let's go. It's a 24% discount spell service 266. Alright, time seven. I, I, look, I cover it. Don't worry. 1862. We'll got it. The Grouch Easy. Couch. Oh, uh, I spelled that wrong. <laughs> the Grouch Cough. As soon as you said fiery, I'm like, nope. Take my earrings out. And take my rings off. I feel like one thing, one thing Jade's gonna say in canon before we leave. Oh man, I love your red hair. Shut uh, the fuck up. Don't pay. No, nope, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna cover all interactions next week. <laughs> Give you guys plenty of. Oh uh... shit. Oh no, they have subscriber only. Now we're gonna cancel. I was gonna do that because they was playing fucking Fallout. I was like, ooh, Fallout, but they have subscriber only chat. Oh, not that. Um, what's Gingy? I haven't seen Gingy in a while. Oh my god. Yeah, Dead by Daylight. Two eyes, right? Three eyes. Uh, three eyes. Yeah. So we, we got a long rest, right? Uh, yes. yes. Several. Several. Perfect. Yes. Easy. You're going to have to heal me up because I'm going to burn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, at that note, we'll I see you guys. Not. We'll see you guys next week. <laughs> Bye. 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 So excited. It just reminds I've me. Been, of, I've um, thought about how Jane would would talk to her. <laughs> I was no just thinking about all of the stories from 